<laughs> Hello? Hello, is this thing on? Hello, testing, one, two, one, two. Hello? What the fuck? Hi, howdy. Oh, <laughs> how's it, how's it going? Corbs here with another Red Dead RP stream as George Hughes on the Diablo RP server. What's good? Howdy, Shelby. MJ, hello. Oh man, how you doing? A long time since we chatted. I'm busy at work as always. Oh, I feel that. What have you been doing in your role-playing adventures? What's the recap? Oh, golly. Uh, 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 about a, a month ago? I think there was like, I think it was like a month ago. There was a, a full server reset. So like, everything was wiped. Uh, you could remake your characters, but it's all like, um, generally everyone's memory is lost. Some people abuse that and they just happen to remember fucking everything and they find loopholes, which is bullshit, but you know, people are going to be people, right? Um, but generally it was a, it was a big reset. So, um, I think that was about a month ago, I think, um, God, uh, still in the law department, but on a, like a bit of leave just cause I'm busy with some stuff IRL, uh, over the next week. Um, I'm just trying to deal with that. Um, God, what's happened since the reset? Um, God, it's tough to answer. That's tough to answer. I'm not, I don't know. <laughs> Like, there hasn't been, like, like a Mountain Man level storyline yet or anything. Um, not to say nothing good has happened, but there hasn't been, like, you know, something big like that yet. If that makes sense. Oh, look, we woke up. We survived the night after losing all the blood. <laughs> So, hello, Boinks. Did I say hello, Boinks, before? I think I may have thought it, and I, but I didn't say it. Hello, Boinks. How are you? How are you going? Howdy, howdy, howdy. I also have had a no-repeat characters between my show, which fixed that. That's... Look. Yeah, look. If people can't just... If people can't do something as simple as, you can remake the character, but you don't remember anything. Like, if that... Like... That is, that's not, I don't think that's hard to, to understand. I don't think that's hard to understand. I think that's a pretty fair thing. But, yeah, but. But then you just got to go drive literally to the supermarket and you can see just how disappointing people are. <laughs> So, no, I see, I can see why that would be required. I can see why that would be required. I recall you've been playing it as a vampire and the other two characters you played, that's what I recalled. Oh, golly, yeah, that was, yeah, it's been a minute. Um, yeah, I, I don't know if I'll ever bring back Leinhardt Valdemar. Um, uh, cause yeah, he's, you know, he, he would be back at square one after the reset and... As some people may remember, I had to do a lot of mining, um, mainly off stream, just so he would have some money so that I could just do fun stuff on the stream. And the thought of doing, starting from scratch with that, I was like, nah, look, maybe I won't bring him back, hey. Um, but then again, another disappointing thing was a lot of people didn't play along with that he's a vampire. Like the devs were really cool and actually let me have like the bat ability and stuff. But then every second person would take one look at him and be like, that guy's a vampire. And it's like, oh, why? Like, people just didn't want to... Like, a lot of people just didn't want to play along with it. So it's like, cool. Thank you. Thanks for thanks for being real cool. Um, appreciate it. Um, let's see. When you want to do something cool, I might not return the favor. And you'll just have to deal with it. I have a good memory. Thank you for the luck, Dill. I hope your Elden Ring has been going alright. I was um yeah, I was lurking while I was playing some 
I finally uh, finished all the DLC for Fallout 3 for the first time in my life, and I finally got a character to level 30 again for the first time in my life. Um, took me a minute. <laughs> um, yeah, you looked like you were having trouble with a boss. Um, I was like, that's brutal. Hope you got through it. <laughs> um... I'm alright, Boinks, but I will, I will, hopefully, I will either be better, I will hopefully be better, or at least have less on my mind within the, within, within a week's time, which I'm really looking forward to. Um, it's just, there's a bunch of stuff going on at the moment that I'm really looking forward to being over. But, we'll see. <sighs> Um, at the moment, it is still just George Hughes, but like this is the 2.0 version, but he's essentially the same. It's just a, a different stuff has or has not happened. Um, I attempted, I, wa I was planning on having a funny Albert Groves character um, get going and he was going to pursue a job with trains, but um, I just haven't had time to to take that seriously with doing George Hughes stuff and then IRL stuff, so it's just been George. Just, just George. Um, I just don't have the time and energy to commit to two characters at the moment. No worries, Boinks. Thank you for the lurk. Hope you have hope you're having a hope you have a good night. <laughs> hope everything's well with the little ones. I've heard that Wild RP has a new patch called Life, Death, and Play. Oh! Yeah, no, um, no, I saw that come up, and I had a look at their trailer. Like, it's a lot of, like, little, like, quality of life things, and, like, just little, like, just, just things to help people just get more immersed. Really cool. Really cool. No, I, I um, I am endeavouring to learn more about Wild RP because I'm trying to organise a panel for PAX where I'll be hosting it, and then it'll be a number of, uh, streamers and players on the panel, um, and we've got one Wild RP streamer amongst them. Um, I try, I tried to get more, but they're busy or not responsive, but I would like to share the love on servers in general, rather than just this one, just so everything's fair. Yo, Thor, howdy, howdy. Sure, <laughs> Albert ran me over and was never seen again. That was that was that was very funny timing. That was very funny timing. <laughs> I love the way Alexi's like, my friend. This is her literally her first time in country, and this happens, and I'm like, oh man, it wasn't personal or anything. It was, and I, it wasn't meant to be outright. Um, RDM or whatever. It was meant to be funny. Like, the character's clumsy and shit. Like, it wasn't... It wasn't meant to be malicious. I'm sorry. <laughs> what was the buy my character? Oh, it's essentially the same old George Hughes. Essentially the same old. Howdy, Hammer. How you going, mate? That's right, PAX in Melbourne, boys. Yes, yes, yes. I'll be going again this year. Um, hopefully, um, in a perfect world, um, in a perfect world, I will be hosting a Red Dead RP panel with six pounds. Oh! Howdy, Louisa! Howdy! Oh, look at this madness. Get down. How you doing How today? How are you doing today? Oh! <laughs> Jinx! Sorry, it's against the law for you to talk now, I'm afraid. You, uh, you can't speak until Woodman boots I you. I love the name. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. You are released from the spell. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> so what's on for today? Is Scotty still gonna there's work a, there's a There's a deer on the roof. Oh, there it is. Look at it. Oh, it's gone. It might come back. Yeah. Uh, look, I... Look, I really just haven't given much thought of what I'm gonna be doing today. I was just resting up after... You probably heard I got mauled by a bear last night. Yeah. Yeah, how are you feeling? Look, better, 
better than last night. Uh, Good I'm very lucky have? that Miss Wheeler was there. She put me right back together and made sure. The owner of uh, this fine oh. establishment, oh, uh, Sexy Stallions. Oh my God, they're loud. Uh -huh. Their voice just carries. Well, that's Alexi, oh. yeah. Little bit of pocket change, you know. Keep your voice down! I'm. You're yelling. <laughs> I need everybody to know that uh, you need to come to Sexy Stallions. But you keep Make your a voice poster! Down. Also, George, you're always yelling. Because I gotta tell everyone in the town to follow the fucking law! <laughs> Look, facts. Alright, follow the law and come to Sexy Stallions. Wait, God damn it! <laughs> Keep it like sexy, come see Alexi. contest out here or what? <laughs> what? Say something? No! Yes! You know what? What? Exactly! Yes, uh, the business is now called Sexy Stallions. You want it sexy? Come see Alexi. I need money first. Very, very nice. I give oh, a shit. Shot. I'm gonna find you for polluting the. No, this is. Money. I'm back. I'm back to normal. I'm just loud. Um, no, don't worry. I give uh, sheriffs a good discount and medics. Oh, thank you. Appreciate Except that. Except for George. I'm. I'm wow. hoping to get an assessment done today. Oh, Later should not. So. I, I mean, look. If uh, your horse is probably going to get oh. shot a lot, so I need to make sure that you keep coming to me for business. So I need to make a chip, you know. How do y'all? Howdy. Howdy. How's your new horse going? I don't think she's doing alright. Wait, what? New horse? Yeah. Where's Henry? Nice. Henry's in the stable. Henry! I want to see a. I want to see a shine. <laughs> Look at this, George. Yeah. Would, this would you like to adopt Henry? I would, but I. But then I'd have to. I wouldn't have time to look after him. Oh, I, I thought you liked him. I do, right, but I'll tell. I'll tell her that you don't like him. No, I. I. Hi, Derek. I, I don't have the time to look after two horses. No, that's fair enough. I'll find someone to pass oh. him on to. Is there a lot? Is there a doctor nice. recruit? This one doesn't look sick. Medical recruit no. you could pass Henry on to? Part of the application oh, for the doctors Henry is that you already go. have to have a fast horse and a gun. Oh. Oh. I'll, I guess oh. I'll hold on to him for now Maybe, in case uh, I need to go faster because uh, I need to bond with my horse yet. Yeah. Maybe, um, uh, Eric. Uh, Eric already got given a horse. The, just, uh, he got oh, given Mary he Shelley from uh, just, William. Oh, okay. Just make sure that it then an asshole whoever gets him or I will continue no, to steal I know. him. I know. Yeah. Well you can probably continue to steal him anyway. Oh I'm Dirt, look him out. I don't horse. intend to stop him. Henry, yeah, we were just Which admiring him. I wanted to see him next to a Shire, so Terence is gonna get his name his. is Persephone. Oh nice, God. I like it. Holy shit. These horses beautiful. are fucking oh. huge! Mm -hmm. It is fucking he, huge. He this is a thick horse. Beast. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Beast. Yeah, yeah, thick horse is Damn. definitely the right way to describe him. Hopefully she won't throw you off. No, she'll be sturdy. Oh, that's uh, that's we actually nice. took out like uh, we, we took out the Ardennes mm. Gypsy Car Vendishire yesterday for the first ride to see how they <laughs> look next to each other. It was like little, medium, and what's, big. Uh, what's the gypsy like next to this one? Smaller than this one. Oh my god. Yeah, Gypsies like... are not impressive anymore with all these horses nope. running around yeah, county. So... It's it's so weird looking at uh, them on their own. They're like, oh yeah, that's a big horse, but then you see them next to each other, and you're like, nope, <laughs> that one. Mm -hmm. oh, that one's that one's hole. the bigger one. <laughs> I like their fluffy hooves. So do I. You, you look like that got fluffy boots on. Yeah. She, she is very uh, a wide though. Yeah. She's very she's. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Look at that! Someone got a donkey. <laughs> got the smallest horse next to the biggest horse. It's a dinosaur! Yeah. How does the asshole line up? I think he's... Oh, he ran away. He heard me talking about him. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god. That horse tried to murder me It takes a lot, a lot more effort today. to get on top of Persephone than it does Henry. <laughs> oh, I bet. <laughs> That's a long I'm not waiting up. for permission. No, I know. Oh my god, she's so big. Cute. 
Anyway, Henry, Henry um, was up in the hotel yesterday. Top floor. Was he now? No wonder he was happy this morning. <laughs> we were gonna find you and just tell you to oh. just just go check out the top floor, but you weren't around. You left him behind as usual. I was busy dealing with a bear attack victim. <laughs> I guess that makes sense. It wasn't Alexi. Speaking of, how are you feeling, George? Uh, oh, it was George. <laughs> Better. I did check on you multiple times through the night to make sure you were still breathing. Yeah, I, I woke up fine as rain, I think. Yeah, those bears oh. have a hell of a bite on them. Yeah. Hit the ankles. Well, he got attacked by a wolf, and then about 15 seconds after we got the wolf down, maybe then the bear came out. So That's organized crime right there. That yeah. is. That is bullshit. I don't think they should be working like that. I was, uh... Inform the government be like, these animals are setting up posses and they're not registering them. It did feel like a coordinated attack. Yeah, those wolves, man, they're bastards. I feel like they set our roadblock sometimes. <laughs> oh, but, but yes, Louise, to answer your question before, uh, yeah, I, I don't didn't really have any plans for today, but yeah, if the doctors would like another escort, I, I have nothing on my calendar. Hey, George. Yeah. Mm. Do you want to see mine and Terrence's new outfits? Yes. Awesome. Wait right there. I won't go anywhere. Let's go, Terrence. <laughs> Here we go. Um, yeah. I'm hoping to get my um, assessment done later this evening so I can fit in a little bit more training before then. That'd be great. I've been reading over my notes and, and stuff today. I'm gonna go to the saloon real quick. I'm getting real thirsty. I have nothing on me. I'll be back. That horse will drink all the water. It's <laughs> <laughs> gonna drink the river dry. Look at the proud trot it's got too. Is, are there are there bigger horses than that? I'm than not the sure. Shire, or I think the Shire is the biggest. So yeah. I can't ima I can imagine if a horse gets bigger than that. That'd be oh, terrifying. Yeah. I mean, normal horses scare That's... the shit out of me in general sometimes. <laughs> they just roll on over you. That big one, man. You call that, you gotta get out of the way. <laughs> just knock you straight over. Imagine if it was going to sleep and it rolled over on you. That'd be... That's it. Done. I, you're I, done. Yeah, that... That's it. You're done. Oh, what the hell? Going to the snow, are we? Do you love it? Uh, <laughs> you're pinking out. It's look. I love the that you're in sync. Uh, it looks nice and and warm, especially if you're going up into the snow. Um, I suppose if there's any pink blood in the snow, you'll blend right in with that. <laughs> uh, it kind of fits with the color scheme of the horse. Yeah, it's a it's a great time. <laughs> what was he called us, Lily? Hmm? The, the, I call them the Pink Panthers. Oh, that's they, it. Uh... Oh, Jesus! Sorry. Where the first Persephone doesn't understand personal spice yet. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. I need to get my... I need to get a winter outfit sorted. Yeah. Oh, so do I. Hey, why don't you, we have a match nice outfits like that, George? Well, yeah, for our win, oh, winter, for the for the snow trip. Yeah, we should that's, coordinate. That's a, that, we could coordinate. That's a, a couple thing. Have you guys got news? No. <laughs> oh, it's a, the army dresses up in sync. They're not a, in a big harem. Yes, they are. I know, you know I've heard the army that I know. stories about that army. They all jump in the shower together. Actually, yes, I was wearing my outfit that has my orange bandana on. I guess I matched you then, George. <laughs> oh, and I was wearing my green shirt. You know, great minds think alike. Mm -hmm. Maybe well, I mean, we should you, make you outfits and, that match and George and then and tell Mr. everyone that he's a gang leader. He is a gang leader. <laughs> I'm not I'm a gang, gang leader. leader. Yep, Are you leading the posse now, George? No! Let, no, let me just George. take a mental note of George's outfit. This... 
the judge. I know that you're on leave from being a, uh, like a sheriff, but I didn't really think you'd go down that bad path straight I'm away. I'm not! I... He did. You should hear the things he tries to make us do. I've been mending in a bed! I ain't got time to run a gang! He does, and his initiation is um, killing every now. local in Blackwater. He told us to do that, Cynthia. Do what? I'm traumatized. Um, well, I, I'm not local to Blackwater, so... I'll just oh, observe. That's lucky. <laughs> I don't know what the hell they're talking about. <laughs> it's not. We should tell. We should I'm tell hungry. Harkness about it next time we see him. But we have to be dressed in our George clothes. Pardon? Start a whole thing. I could, look, I could tell you one of three things he'll say. Yep. I think he'll just laugh. Oh, that's nice. Could, could we just say that the George, uh, George Hughes uh, fan club? We all dress the same. I, I don't, I don't, I can't remember who I was talking about. But I am, I am not about to start a, a campaign with this sheriff election. I, I don't believe in it. I don't think you really need to start a campaign. You already just done enough. I just, you should just. If if people haven't noticed the the, the good things I try to do, then so be it. I don't need no fan club, please. We need to help we'll spread the about word me. of all the good stuff that he's done. No, you, no, don't, no, don't false it. That's the thing. I, Did I, you know that no. George single-handedly funded a whole orphanage in St. Denny? No, I, no, that's <laughs> a lie. Oh, no. Did you know that on his weekends he distributes bread to the homeless people? Oh, no, what, what a good I've, heart I've, you have. I've seen George. that. No, I don't. I've seen that. You, that's You're a lie. You're George. I'm kidding. Stop stressing out. It's, it just makes me feel yucky. I can't wait to make orange outfits. <gasps> we uh, should put up a post on that notice board about George. No, no, I don't. Oh, yeah. I don't want to eat any of that. We just found the notice board. Oh, well, no. I'm going to escape this conversation and go get dressed. <gasps> Let's start wearing orange ponchos. Nope. Oh, God. It's done. You, you can Love hop it. on the back if you want to escape, George. Okay. Are you, uh, <laughs> are you going on duty? Sorry. I am already on duty. Oh, can I join you? <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Thanks. I'll go get changed too. Uh, should we put our other stuff back on? I'm just gonna be in my head for a second. That's fine. Okay. Um, what did I miss? What did I miss? What's what's another nickname? Thor. Yes, Boinks. Yeah, definitely. Let me know if you go again. Yo, Frog. Frog, we need more lawmen in the West. Oh, Cam, you'll have to find out in character. I can't, just come to supervise our I can't remember what Terrence's last name is, MJ. The one of me running into the pole, Cam? That was funny. Where's the tailor? I'm primarily a lawman, but I'm currently on a break. Oh, you're just getting changed, Cynthia. Yeah, what? Oh, just, yeah, if you ever get an idea of what the uh, the the snow outfit should look like, let me know. Oh, yeah, good point. I need to make a little bit of money before I do that, though. I yeah, spent no all rush. my money on the horse. Look, after getting attacked by a bear, I'm not in a rush. We'll, we'll get you back hunting. Yeah. And I promise I will be less reckless and slower and uh, good, better at shooting things. Yeah, and, I'll, and I'll, I'm going to reach for my gun quicker. Yeah, you didn't quick throw like I showed you. No, I, no, hey, I really didn't. Doing? I really did not. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, y'all need a, y'all need security tonight. Oh yeah, always. Who knows what could happen? Oh, happy to help again. Uh, I see Louise is doing her butchering. Oh, there is a. You have to find the special spot. You, you, to... you do you, frog. So you no pressure, man. Wherever he went. Oh, he's over there. She is. Sorry, it's a girl. Your horse? Yeah. Persephone, she's right? Hole. She's very wide, so she gets stuck. Oh, oh no. Oh, she's trying. Oh, she's doing her best. Come on, Persephone. You can come up a little bit more. There we go. I'm surprised you can say her name. Uh, somebody said that you might not be able to pronounce her name. Who said that? Uh, I don't want to snitch. 
What's, what, what's wrong with my pronunciations? No, you got it right. You pronounced it correctly and Alexi didn't and Alexi named it. Who's been well. slandered my pronunciations? <laughs> well, anyway, her short name is Percy. Who was it, Cynthia? I'm not, I'm not telling. You ain't gonna tell me. You shouldn't bring that up. No, no, I just butchered it. I'm only messing with you. Oh, yeah. Alexi calls her Persephone instead, though. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> she is a lot bigger than Georgie. Yeah. Jo I, I, I thought Georgie would be shorter. Georgie's got long legs. Just yeah. a little head, though. Head. And she's smelly. <laughs> she's happy though. She don't kick people. Except for me. Uh, I'm in the I'm in the West Law Department. I'm a I'm a captain. El Capitan. That light. Oh my god, I can't see. Oh. It's like we're escorting doctors again tonight. Where are we heading? Armadillo? Sounds good, as long as it's not tall trees. I won't take you back to the scene of your trauma, don't you worry. I appreciate that. I figured a nice long ride would be good because uh, I need to bond with Persephone here. Oh yeah, a good long trip is good. It really can be luck of the draw, hey, frog. Mama always said people would like a box of chocolates. You don't know what you're gonna get. Where's the name Persephone from again? Uh, she's a figure in Greek mythology. She's Hades' wife. Oh, his wife. She was forced to marry him, and every time that she leaves the, uh... well, all right, full story, in part, is that she was kidnapped, taken to the underworld, and she was told that if she ate any food there, bad things would happen. She ended up eating six pomegranate seeds. 
So now uh, she was doomed to spend half of her year in the underworld. And uh, because of that... Pardon? Oh. oh I, can't, I can't hear you back here. Oh, I was yelling. Oh. Sorry. That was, that's all right. Uh, how much did you hear? Uh, you said she had to spend half a year down there? Yeah, so the six months of a year that she has to spend down in the underworld is the six months that we have as winter and autumn. And that's when the plants die. Oh. And things get miserable because she has been doomed to be in the underworld for half a year. Oh, I see. Yeah, but when she is here, we get spring and we get summer. Oh. Oh, so oh. she... So she always has to go back. Always has to go back because she ate six pomegranate seeds. How does Hades get anything done while she's gone? What, you think he needs his girl around to get things done? I imagine it's a stressful job. Run in the underworld? Yeah. Uh, something tells me the point of the story is it's stressful being his wife. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Anyway, she's just a lady who was trapped in a marriage she didn't want. I wonder where I've heard that before. Yeah, it's mm. crazy. What's the name of your horse, Louisa? This one's called Lapis. Lapis? What's I that? Yeah. Well, uh, I think it might be part of that. Uh, there's a stone, a gemstone, Lapis Lazuli. Um, but I didn't get to name it, so. Oh, but you this like one it? Was, this one's a hand-me-down from Alexis. Oh. My first horse named was a uh, Lady. Oh. Yeah. Hey, George, what's your horse's name and how did you name it? Georgie. Oh, how did you make that name? I had a pet. George and Georgie. Yeah, I had a pet dog called that as a child, and I really didn't think. Yeah. It's personal, and it's uh, easy to remember. Yeah, my my parents went too imaginative, and it's kind of stuck. Sometimes I think when we're around people and I talk about your horse and I say Georgie, they think I'm talking about you instead. <laughs> it's like when I got mauled by a bear and Joseph came to help me. And I said, Henry abandoned me here. And he assumed Henry was a person. Oh. And he thought a man had left me to die in the forest. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Let me just check my car. I had a feeling we shouldn't have gone to cross that bridge. Oh. No, we'll be fine. I'm learning how to navigate without using the map. Because that's what Shuber has told me I should be doing. Mm -hmm. It was a bit hard to see with uh, this fog, though, that's all. Yeah. Barely seen the front. That's right. Cynthia loves her land. I do. I'm glad you got it. I can see you ahead now. So, uh, William Selage's first horse, Mary Shelley, is named after the author who wrote Frankenstein. Oh. And then his second horse's name is Vern, which is also another author. And, uh, but he just gave Mary Shelley to Eric. Howdy. Is William all right? He couldn't stay out of my lap last night. Um, I get it. I, I get it. He was very appreciative of me, you know, escorting <laughs> y'all last night. But, you know, I'm not expecting anything no, as payment I, like that. I think he just really wanted to play poker. That's all. Good. <laughs> Look, if he needs a hug, he can just ask. Well, he doesn't have to... T take me to court or anything, you just give me a hug. Hey, Louisa. Mm hmm. Yeah, have you heard that, uh, you know, one of the most important things about being a doctor is you always have to be prepared for anything? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! You were right. prepared? Oh no! Yeah. Oh no, oh, my Louisa! <laughs> You're on the Persephone! Ground. 
prepared! Be prepared! <laughs> Got her! Oh, <no>. <laughs> <laughs> Whoop! That was not what I wanted to bring out. Jesus! <laughs> so fun in games! Oh, there you go. <laughs> She's gotta be more prepared. I thought I was prepared. I was prepared to take your horse. <laughs> <laughs> about him stealing all the booze out of my saddlebags. <laughs> well, the thing is, is he told us he was after all the morphine in the saddlebags, so I don't even keep my oh. morphine in the saddlebags. My morphine's yeah. in my bandolier all the time. Joke's on him, I don't have any morphine. <laughs> <laughs> How much alcohol have you got in your saddlebag? Uh. Wolves on the left! <laughs> all right. Let's oh, they're go. running off. Yeah, they don't want to mess with those. I think I got, um, uh, there's some whiskey, some rum, Kahlua, I think there's a snake bite whiskey in there. Oh no. <laughs> is that all for work or is that for after work? Well, I, I was collecting it just for special occasions. Um, Aww. I don't drink that often. You looking forward to a, another special occasion, like a dance with the governor? Oh yeah, yeah. Just waiting for, uh, uh, waiting for that notice in the newsletter. Did you see the notice he put up today about needing to protect the uh, medical? Things? I did. I did. Mm -hmm. It was very, very good to see that. Good to see he can hold up his end of a bargain, I guess. Actually, I found the uh, community of Valentine were very generous. Last night, we were all sitting around the campfire, and uh, it started off as a joke. They were saying, oh, no, don't, please donate to the, this business and donate to the rangers, and I've gone, oh, donate to the poor medic recruit who didn't get paid today because oh, the system yep. broke. And so they all offered with some food. Derek was very nice and gave me enough money to get my horse last night. Yeah, yeah. So I'm very appreciative of the, That's of nice the of generosity. Yeah, mainly to keep my pockets full of food. <laughs> oh, and uh, I've heard that um, really should try and carry some hay. Because it's really good for the horses. Um, yeah, I forget to sock up, but at least I have... I have few, quite a few apples on me right now. <laughs> yeah, well, the hay, a handful of hay will um, fill your horse right up full of energy oh. and help, like, while you're riding. So you don't need to slow down if, if your horse gets tired. So yeah, I'm keen to get more. They don't have a bathtub here, do they? Nope. You gotta go to usually to tumbleweed, I think. No, wait, maybe not. Oh. No, yeah, wait, there should be one here. Yeah, hang on. 
Yo, yo Rachel. They have a tendency to lock the door after. Oh, that's right. Yo, 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 Rachel. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna do it as now. It's been all right. It's problem. been relaxing mostly. Oh, it. It's been all right. Being around here. Have you had a good nervous. one? <sighs> it's just Miss. It's Miss Zelda. Howdy. Bye then. Oh. I'll be in my head just for a minute. I'll be. Okay. I suppose it'll be more livelier down here on Tuesday. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely sounds like something that I could do week. Um, definitely weekly that keep people coming down. Oh, I'm. I, I've been counting down the days till the next one. I missed the last one. Oh yeah. I'll have to yeah. get a double helping of tacos this week. <laughs> I think I came along and someone had just bought everyone uh, all the tacos. So we were waiting for more to be made. Wait, they and, bought all of yeah. them? Yeah, someone, I think, I, I'm sure he said something like he had 70 or something. And then, 70? Yeah. How much is each went. taco? $4? Four dollars? Four dollars? Four dollars? I can't remember. Times seventy? What? Yeah. You don't think they nope. would just take nope. them and then go and sell them at a high price somewhere oh, else, would they? Come on, get. Surely oh, not. That would be. I mean, yeah, unless he had a big group he was sharing them with. Yeah, like Maybe a... he was having a party. Yeah, it's BYO Taco. She's <laughs> generous. Look, I brought one for everybody. <laughs> I, I really hope they're not taking them and then selling them somewhere else. I feel like is that? Yeah, that wouldn't be. Would that be illegal? That would be nice. Is that frowned mm -hmm. upon? What would you call that? Ta like taco theft? It's not theft yeah. though, because he's bought them. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Legal taco trading. That's what's the world coming to? Mm. Let's do a little lap around Tumbleweed and we can consider our new okay. Austin work done today. Doom, doom, doom. Hey, Cynthia? I had a question. Yeah, what's that? Uh, how do we treat swine flu? Terrible remedy, usually. Okay. It doesn't, uh, doesn't quite react the right way with antibiotics you'd expect. So, terrible remedies go. All right. So, do we use the antibiotics for anything else? I'm not sure. I haven't experienced that yet. I haven't had anything to use on that. Every time I've tried, they weren't like, no, let's use a herbal remedy. So. Oh, okay. Nah, I, so on my, on my leave of absence from the Law Department, yeah. um, it's like just sort of happened where been um, I've been sort of working as, like, you know, uh, unofficial security yeah. Yeah. for the doctors. Just because they've been experiencing a lot of hardships recently, like people threatening them, taking them hostage, and stuff like that. So it's just sort of happened. Well, yeah, George is it's just sort of yeah taking the time out of his day to just escort the doctors around, 
have their back in case something happens. Nothing's happened yet on his watch, but you never know. You never know. Well, some stuff, there was a night I didn't play, and that's when, yeah, they were being taken hostage and stuff, so. But nothing's happened while I've been on. From from my experience, yeah. okay. just from the West uh, perspective, even if you uh, treat somebody uh, for a snake bot, you can. Since the, the reset, um, since the okay, reset, the most wanted people, I think, was Calder. Calder Wild is was it Wiles no and John Black, I believe, was the bullet. most want have been the most wanted Ooh, so far. I think, but that's. I don't know. On the west side, anyway. Same way you would deal with frostbite, to be honest. You have the triage based on the patient. But most burns that we see is just run them under cold water and air low. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes you can compression bandage them so they won't feel it as much. And uh, okay. you can also do topical injections of cocaine in a liquid form. And that can help do what we call a nerve block. So it stops uh -huh. the body from feeling. Okay. Wasn't too long ago. Uh, I think it was maybe in the last 20 years or so they figured out how to do some some things like that. Uh, there was a fellow who did a uh, uh, a surgery that were basically had to put a tube in somebody's throat. They call it a tracheostomy or something. And uh, he performed that after giving them a nerve block, so he shot directly. Into the nerve. Yuck. Oh. Wow. Okay. Not a great. Uh, Procedure though, there's high rate of failure. I suppose that's not something we can do on the road, is it? It's more for like in a. Some surgery. nerve blocks we definitely could, but yeah, a lot of these techniques are surgical that we'd need to do in a in a proper room equipped for it. Sure. Hope we're not uh, grossing you out with any of the medical talk. Oh, as long as it's not peeling a snake like a banana, it's fine. Well, we are in New Austin, so. Oh no. That is still very much on the table. Yikes. Craziest moment on the server. I hope she don't get stuck in that bath. Uh, I might be mistaken, but the one that comes to mind was the time that a gang set up a fake bank robbery just to lure me and another lawman in, just to take us hostage, to then take us to see a criminal doing time at Siska Prison. That was that was that was crazy. That what comes to mind. That was awesome. That was so unexpected that night. What's the verdict? Nope. Can you get a bath? No, it's the uh, doors are locked. That ain't good. <laughs> All right, next stop, I'll show you this nice house I found. Zoom, zoom, zoom. The 
there's this uh, sweet house down here, and I hope one day we can we can maybe look at buying it or something. Oh yeah. This is my yeah, kind I of place. Seen some of the, I have seen some of the properties are popping up now. Oh. oh, this is nice. Sometimes I come here for lunch. You do? Oh, oh. Oh, th this is cute. And cozy. Where did George go? He's around on the back. Oh. Howdy. 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 Cozy little place. Yeah, this is my kind of place, I think. Be enough for me. And it's fairly remote, quiet. Mmm, can't put a price on it. Some peace and quiet. So where's next after here? We'll probably head out of uh, New Austin and head up Strawberry Van Valentine. All right. Cozy yeah. little place. Uh, it's nice. Did it you is. Put, dye your hair red or you put blood in it? No, that's the blood you from got, the deer you got that blood I had. In it. Yeah. Right. it makes you look yeah. like a ginger. <laughs> I'm just helping you. <laughs> I can see and that. I can, I can be as fiery. Don't tell William. As confident as you. <laughs> oh, dear. I keep making fun of him because he uh, has two friends who both have red hair. I keep saying that he collects gingers and has a very specific top. Oh. <laughs> Don't tell him I said that. He might get offended. That's though. very wishful thinking that we can coordinate finding two to three people to bodyguard doctors that already have a limit on how many they can ride in a group. bump into Mr. Wolf, but we'll probably see him later at some point. Oh, yeah. Seen the oh, yeah. Yeah. Ever since yeah. I ran in, ran into his horse and knocked it over that one time, now we seem to run into oh. each other constantly. In better ways. Okay, yeah, that's good. ways to do oh. Oop, some jobs. Watch out, I hear a cougar. Oh, you do? Oh. I think I, did I hear it? No. Yeah, I think it's more that there is a new Austin way of doing things. Oh, okay. They don't even have a telephone at the sheriff's department down here. Oh. That doesn't surprise me. I don't know if they even get paid. Do you think he just does it for fun? Well, I, I think they have to take what they earn from uh, catching drug deals and such. But yeah, if, they, if nothing like that's happening, they don't get paid. He tells me that there's constant drug deals happening around here. Oh, dear. I have no idea where. I've explored a lot of New Austin. 
There was one time I helped out with what seemed like it might be a situation in Tumbleweed, but that was just one 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 occasion. Slow down. Got to carry a. Blood's kind of sticky. Uh, we might need to tunnel to that one, but I don't think oh. that. Oh well, they can sort of wait. The yeah, we'll take we'll take the ride. That is near roads. You could always, okay. I could always meet you there. Yeah, you sure you want to? Well, your 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 job comes first. Yeah, that's right. All right, we'll oh. see you in roads. See you We're there. We're gonna head to uh, Armadillo and take. Wait, hang on. The tunnel in Armadillo. Where is it? Louise, do you know what the tunnel is? I think it might be behind uh, yes, the other doctor's office. If you have to move on from roads, just send me a telegram and I'll I'll right. check it. Got a long ride. Evening, Dub. Hey, Dun. Where you going? Oh, jealous. I haven't been to Europe. Well, Germany. I've only really been to Germany and Europe, but I haven't been to I haven't been to Europe since 2019. It's actually over here. You all right? Hello. You okay there, partner? I am his horse. Pardon? So far. Horse fell off the cliff. Oh, you need a ride somewhere? Back into town. Well, if you'd like a quick ride back into town, I can take you there now. Yes. All right, climb aboard. I'll ride you in just to rest your legs for a minute. Have food. I hungry, very much so. Sure, I, I've probably got a spare frontier fillet or something. Yeah. yeah. Stomach struggling. Ah, oh, bad. After all that running, it's hard to hear about that. Let me uh. This. One on one. There you go, pawn. I hope that helps. Oh, I hope you hope your luck turns around, friend. Uh, I, I gotta get to Rhodes. Oops, sorry. You stay safe now. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Poor guy. Well, his horse went off the cliff. Well, there's my good deed for the day. Two thousand eight was when you were last there. Damn, that's morning. That's ages uh, ago now. Okay then. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the fuck? Hello, amigo. Howdy. Ha ha. What's so funny? You remember me, amigo. Hey. You remember me, amigo? Uh. Can't say I do. Mehan from uh, Saint Denis. 
Oh, the one stealing the doc the horses from the doctors. Ah, uh, see, see. Ah, uh, see you down here. Yeah, you what, you you gone home to see your family or something? Uh no, amigo. I just come to uh, find myself a lovely horse that looks like you got one there, amigo. Oh nah, Georgie here's you know apparently not so lovely. Apparently, apparently Georgie's stinky. Oh really? Oh see, see, see. Yeah, I'm afraid there's a. Uh, there's much nicer horses around, I've been told, but uh, oh, you know, I, I thought I was doing a good job taking care of it, but apparently not. I see, see. Hmm. What else you got on you uh, there, amigo? Well, I just gave a Native American fella some frontier fillet because he was hungry and his horse fell off the cliff, so if you'd like a bowl of that, I could definitely share one with you. Uh... What? Uh, I got some meat. You want some meat? Uh, no. Um, or maybe I. Uh, you want some orange maybe, juice? Maybe I uh, take horse. Oh no, you'd find there's much better horses elsewhere. Oh, nice horse. I go find uh, doctor's horse, yeah. Oh, the doctors are far from here by now. They're heading around over to uh, the east side. Oh, see. See whereabouts? Uh, Saint Denis. Saint Denis again. See, see, see. Yeah, you know a lot of people there. A lot of accidents. Oh, see, see, see. <laughs> okay, okay. So, uh, uh, see. Okay. Uh, okay. What we do is, uh, I tell you up and I look in your pocket real quick and, uh. Oh come on, you don't need to do that. Uh, no. Oh, why is this bad? Oh, no. oh no. A death wish I'm about to make come true. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Shit. Well, couldn't draw my gun in time. Oh, like you disappeared. Oh, I'm still here. Oh. What? Hello? See? Oh. I'm I'm right here, partner. Oh, okay. You all right? Uh, no. Oh, okay. You having a bit of trouble there? Uh, see, I can't get it up. <laughs> oh, see. Oh dear. Look, I'm I'm not I'm not trying to cause a scene or anything. Uh. Okay, adios. Goodbye. Saved by the game. <laughs> Oh, partner! Careful down the road, there's a gentleman trying to hold people up. He's riding a donkey. Keep your wits about you. He's riding a donkey? Yeah, he's riding a donkey just down there. He's got a mask. He's riding a donkey. He's holding people up. Let's go get him, amigo. You the sure? Sheriffs. Yeah, fuck it. You, you're, you're from down south of the border? Yeah, amigo. Oh, he, well, yeah, he's from down there as well, but I think he's one of the uh, bad ones. I might go have a chat with him. Might be okay then. Oh, look. It, if you're up for it, I just wanted to make sure you had a heads up. Oh, yeah. Oh, gracias. Yeah, he, had, he was having some trouble <laughs> getting his rope up, so he, uh, All right. he did ran he, on... Uh, rub, did he rub you? He tried to, but he couldn't oh. get his rope up. All oh, right. I have a problem getting it up sometimes, too, but... Uh, oh, it happens to the best of us. You know, I got the mushroom for that. Oh, well, at least you're taking care of it. Yeah, all right, let's go have a look at this guy. If I can't find him in two minutes, then I give up. No, nope, no problem. Happy to hell. <laughs> and what do you do, uh, amigo? You a uh, sheriff or something? Uh, well, currently I'm a security escort for doctors. Fantastic. And, uh, well, I, I lost my doctors. They're up, they headed up to Rhodes, and I was Still trying to meet. Here? I think he looks pretty worse for wear. No, no, he, yeah, this is the fella he shot. This, oh, this fella okay. tried to help me, and yeah. then... He, the fella shot him, and I, I tried to draw my gun while they were shooting each other, but I just couldn't, I couldn't get it out. 
So I lost my window of opportunity. But then lucky his rope just kept drooping. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, might be worthwhile telling the rangers, you know, that uh, someone riding a donkey is robbing people. Oh, I agree. Uh, we were we stopped through town just before. No sign of them, I'm, I'm afraid. No sign? They hope they're around later. They sat here I heard they're pretty fucking useless, but... Uh... Oh, I haven't really seen them in action too much, but yeah, I'm a... I would consider uh, Sheriff Wolf a friend. Hola, senora. Oh. That's not a, uh, that's a man, not a woman. Uh, anyway. But yeah, he's got a mask. Same behind us. Wearing a donkey. Oh, that's a, that's a horse by the looks of it. Oh. Oh, he, he might be in town by now. He headed this way. Let's go have a look. Go past the ranger office. It's, um... It's Javier it's Fernandez. Amigo. It's Chachi. One of the original server owners. What's your name, amigo? Uh, George. George Hughes. Ah, mucho gusto. Hola, amigo. Hola, mister. Howdy! Uh, you, uh... uh... You, uh, 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 one of those, uh, rangers? Uh, a ranger recruit, yes. Ah, see. Uh, your, uh, superiors aren't around. This man nearly got robbed. Robbed? Whereabouts? Uh, just up at the, uh, you know, straight out of town, go around the bend, you start going up the hill. Yes. It's around there by a Mexicano man on a donkey, you said. Yeah, Mexican man with a mask, riding on a donkey with, a, I believe, two cattlemen revolvers. He's He likes just, to steal horses from people. Just to be clear, I am also Mexicano, but I uh, do not ride a donkey. So it wasn't me. Oh, no. I yeah, that's two cattlemen and just, also uh, sometimes steal horses, but uh, it's not me. You're a lot nicer than that other fella. That's just... Uh, perhaps he's in town here, do he... He didn't ride the way I came, so unless he went to north or south, then he might be in the I haven't seen a Mexican. I've seen an Indian. That's about it. Surely he was an Indian wearing a mask? Well, he, he says it was the same fella I saw in Saint Denis yesterday hassling the, the doctors, and uh, yeah, he oh, was okay. he was Mexican. But I didn't see his face today, but he did mention some things that only he would have known yesterday. <laughs> Oh, okay. I don't don't have a town. name. I can go on a little patrol, but uh, if you see some other rangers, you should tell them as well. Yeah, yeah, let's go have a look. See, this is, this is some guys down here. Let's have a look. You guys haven't seen any uh, Mexicano man riding a donkey? Uh, uh nope, I have not. Just uh, yourself, and I wouldn't call that a donkey. Oh, okay. Well, uh, this man here to my right, uh, almost got, he got held up just outside of town by a man on a donkey. Oh, okay. Well, well uh, keep your eyes out, you know. I will, yeah, thank you. He loves to steal horses, especially those of doctors. Oh, right. Doctor. Specifically, doctors? Well, he was willing to make an exception with me. Uh, you a doctor? No, sir. How'd you get an exception? That's the exception, you're not a doctor. Cause Maybe. Because I was helping the doctors yesterday when he was hassling them. All right. Oh, right. That's silly. Why would he hassle a doctor? They could save his life. Are you, what, what was your name again? Uh, George Hughes. Yeah, I thought I met you, like the, the moon dancing. Festival thing in gig. Yeah, that was me. Yeah. <laughs> apart, yeah from, uh, apart from the spilling mojito on myself. <clears throat> yeah, I think I spilled more than that on myself. <laughs> <laughs> I, think I had a good a night. Yeah, there's a lot of alcohol there. Party. What the hell? I hear a horse flying around. It's not a donkey, though. No, not a donkey. Where are these uh, damn rangers when you leave them? Uh, yeah, I don't know. 
They're never around. <clears throat> yeah, maybe, maybe they're down the tumbleweed with the uh, Hamilton marshmallows on. That seems to be a favorite. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. You know what? You open a candy shop down here. Those sheriffs would love it. And the rangers <laughs> come down here, get yeah. the marshmallows straight away. <laughs> Pick them up on the way through. Maybe I'll maybe I can own a little side hustle, marshmallow business. Hmm. Maybe tell the bakery to uh, stock him. Yeah, bakery. Oh my god, the bakery's he's pretty good. He does like scones. Oh my god, I love my scones. Mm. Scones ice, and iced teas. Yeah, the iced teas really good. I don't think they had any today though. You could have. What do you uh, What do you guys do for yourself? You know. I own the stables down here. Oh, fantastic! Yeah, I got a distillery up on the hill. I don't have any cheap horses for sale, do you? Because uh, old Duck, old Joe here is uh, <laughs> a bit old. Okay. Uh, well, I wouldn't say horses are particularly cheap, but depending on what you're after, but... Oh, so well, I've got the uh, $29. Well, <laughs> mm, that would probably just get, get me, you... Uh, like an Arabian? Not for that, the $29. That might, oh, I, might, oh. I might get your leg. <laughs> yeah. I'll take your no. leg now and I'll save up the rest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're oh. gonna be saving for a, a bit for an Arabian. Oh, that's the cheapest thing you got. Uh, well, I mean, I could wild catch uh, Morgan for thirty dollars. Thirty dollars? What is this horse I have? It charged me like fifty dollars my horse. Uh. Well, <laughs> I hate to go. Apparently, it's, hey, it's just Joe. I hate to go run and off. Just, I've got to meet some people in roads, but uh. Well, yeah, take get on the road, amigo. We'll do. And thanks for your right. help, and uh, thanks for listening, y'all. Have a good day. Right. See you later. Yeah. Damn it, Mexican man, uh, holding me up on the road. I'm gonna be late to roads. Oh dear. Oh well. Uh, how many are currently logged in on the server? Uh, I think when I jumped on, it was like. 40 something? That was just over an hour ago. What are the role plays are allowed in the server? Hey! What are the role plays allowed in the server? Like, jobs? Probably dehydrating faster out here because I've got a coat on while I'm in the sun. Ah, uh, so there's law, um, and there's there's the west, east, and uh, rangers. Um, you've got the doctors. You've got train companies. You've got businesses like blacksmiths, um, like places that sell food and or drink. Uh, and then you got like. Just sort of like jobs you can just do whenever, like uh, transporting goods by boat, transporting goods by wagon, mining. Um, what else you got? Gold panning. You can do hunting, fishing. Uh, what else is there? I think that's all like the job jobs. Just powering through these orange juices.
no, not tall trees. We don't want to linger here. Oh, you're on the way back. Yeah, I sent you a telegram. So I, I figured I'd check when I get there. I was held up. That's all right. I was well. I was literally held up. I was literally held up by that Mexican fella on the road. Oh, no oh, way. I was just saying. I hope you weren't literally held up. Nah, yeah. He. I was very fortunate that he couldn't keep his rope up, so he didn't get a chance to take my horse or anything. Oh. He's having some performance issues today. He was having some serious performance issues, and then I and then I ran into another a nicer Mexican gentleman, and then uh he he suggested that we head back in Armadillo to quickly check if he was around and talk to the Rangers. So yeah, sorry, sorry, oh. I was delayed. Well, the Rangers all show up after we left. Oh, I think there was one or two, maybe. Was Wolfie there? Unfortunately, no. Goddamn, damn, my man. Well, uh. Might as well continue on a Valentine. We've split the county now, so Raven's taking the east side. All right. Because we, we got to the scene and she was already there. <laughs> All good on her. Yeah. But I, I did have to treat a snake bite. A, a fella got bit by a rattlesnake on the leg. And he showed up to the St. Denny office because he couldn't get antidote. Oh God. Had to give him all tourniquet into the leg so that uh, the venom wouldn't spread up.
Valentine. Oh, yeah, okay. I didn't want to take the rightmost path because I could see myself running into somebody. So I took the left oh. one so I could take the looser turn. Sure. I'm trying to pay better mind to be less reckless today. <laughs> Except for this shortcut up here. <laughs> All right, she took a bigger shortcut than me. Like I said, you need to spend more time with Shuba. He knows every shortcut that man. And he refuses mm -hmm. to use a map and just knows how to get from A to B so fast. Yeah, I'm getting there. I think I've spent a lot of time with William. Uh, he does like to stick to the stick road. Stick to the road? Yeah. And usually goes at slower speed as well. way but I think you know if you two gentlemen actually sat there <laughs> listen I, I'm sorry my, look, my temper is high my temper is high but no just I don't want no one claiming no ownership no, of any town no no but, you, know, you know it's, just, it's I'm just a, you know the general consensus you know it's just a, it's the bullshit that uh you know it's it's this lippiness you know to the law you know it's not yourself but it's you know other folk you know they're interrupting conversations I think uh, you know it's you know it's time to draw the line. Hey, and those that, you know. those two fuckers weren't part of me no, or any no, of, of no. any of my you know. No. It's completely associates. different. Yeah, no, no, that's fine. But like I said, just for, so our you know. for our situation, it was just a one-on-one. -on -one. No one needed to get involved, and unfortunately, it is what it is. Because we all know each other, you know, and uh, you know, I respect you, Mr. Goat. You know, I respect your business, and I, and I love the work that you and your folk do. But uh, yeah, I think some, you know. Um, no one who's who in the zoo is, uh, you know, unfortunately, it's not, uh, you know, we don't all get to, you know, meet everybody. So, you know, you can see why, well, the, shit. Uh, why your assistant, you know, pulled gum. You need to deal with some goddamn bullshit here. Speaking but, of bullshit. Yeah. You touch my horse, too. I'll kill you this time. This is the guy that stole my... He stole your horse, he stole my horse. Get away, get out of here. Uh... Well, uh, you don't, uh, you don't lure me, go fuck off. Oh, no, but this is my shop this... porch, boy. That's the guy that Come here, you son of a bitch. I want to have a talk to you. You on my porch now. I remember you. You put, you put all right, I got a question for you. As much as, Wait, as, much as I may tussle with that man over there, did you take yeah, any of his guns? Or did you try and take any of his guns? It's fine. He's fine. Let him go. 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 Well, and shop and get your business I'm seeing done, but sick, nah, don't cause no trouble in oh, the thing. You're right, partner. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, I'll see you in a sec. Howdy. Joel, oh, shit, sorry. Quick word with you, mate. Joel. You can come here to shop. I was going to stand near my horse. Oh, I hate coming back to this place. Um, <laughs> yeah, I tried to have a word with the marshal, and they all got involved, and now some of them are arrested. Anyway... Oh. By any chance, have you seen the governor or Sage Pena? Uh, not tonight. All right, Sage Pena, as you know, she's my boss that works in the uh, gun shop or owns the gun shop. Mm -hmm. She's uh, missing. Oh. And I'm just going around town to town seeing if anyone has any information. Oh, dear. Yeah. By any chance, would you have any information on the two? Uh, 
Yeah, I, I I haven't seen her. I think in two nights. So two nights. And I haven't heard anything. I'm afraid. All right. No worries. I'll uh, I'll continue my search. Thank I'll, you, Mr. Hughes. I'll tell you. I'll, I'll let you know if I hear anything. I'm sorry to hear that again. Ah, uh, you good, mate. Thank you. No worries. Give you to it. Such a nice polite Christ. report. What was that report? <laughs> a snake. <laughs> Can I please get some help? Like a snake. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. No, he just he rolled straight up, up on the porch with his donkey and, um, you know, some words were exchanged, but I, I didn't witness the uh, uh, him spitting it in his face. But it, it wouldn't fucking surprise me, part I, me. I remember this gentleman. He, uh, yeah, he was in the government building. He put, uh, he wrote, he rolled that down. Yeah. On, in the governor. This the guy. Chair. This is the guy that robbed my, robbed me of my carbon, but then I robbed it back off him. That's right. I remember you telling me that. I remember you telling me that. Yeah. Wait, he, uh, the one that stole Mexico my pies. Guy? And no, he stole my he's... horse yesterday when what I was the... on my way to a call as well. You know what I feel? I think we take him to the oil pit. Oh, that's right. We did. We went out to Mexico. How, how was I think, I think the way we discovered like, the situation out is Gold and uh, this fella here can go to the pig pen and sort the issues out. I think we go to the oil pit. come in here is to shop and then I just get harassed. Yeah, but you had Donkey on his porch. You rode up on my porch? No I Donkey on no porch. You. you fucking did! Donkey on no El Porcho. Stupid gringo, what the fuck does that mean? I think that's a flavor of corn What chip. the fuck does that mean, boy? I was held up by a Mexican gentleman riding a donkey outside on Medillo just now. Just see if that has any weight to look it. Like this guy. Fellow I was dealing with was wearing a mask, but he was riding a donkey. So, so I come into town, I just get harassed by by everyone. Well done, well done, Valentine. I'm, I'm not harassing you, sir. I think because you've happened. stolen from each and every one of us. That's right. Yeah, yeah. I think you've and done you know what? Every you know what, amigo? Person. That's what it's been dealt with. Yeah. Helping us here. That's it for me, as, but not for Maybe these other people. start offering uh, yeah, apologies no, to everyone. Yeah, no, that's already been dealt with, including you and including but you as well. Just because the law dealt with you doesn't mean I have to <laughs> like you. Yeah, well, you know, you you don't go into a town and get harassed by everyone. I, no, because I don't steal people's horses. Maybe you can start by apologizing to everyone. You ain't apologizing to anybody. Maybe you should do that. Good job. Apologize to everyone. Yeah. No, I you apologize everybody you've robbed. No, oh, well, why don't you all uh, apologize to me for stealing everything off my body, yeah? I've been taking no. everything off your body. None of us, I know. Oh, no, you were there, amigo. You you and your little uh, ranger friend. How do you know that? Sorry? I wasn't there. I have no idea what you're talking about, sir. Oh, I'm pretty sure you were, amigo. Uh, do you have any photo evidence of that? Oh, here we go. A sheriff wanting evidence, okay. Hit me head for two sec. Someone watch over me so I don't get fucking robbed. I'm gonna go rob that man, amigo. Hey, I'll go rob that man. That's not a good thing to say aloud. Oh, then you you, you you come in here like harassing me as well, even though I left you alone before, amigo. I'm oh, just... so it was you. Yeah, I see you, amigo. Well, you're wondering why everyone's, you know, not exactly welcoming you into town. I'm just adding to well, it's, it's a very good reason why everyone's just not feeling that great with you rolling up on someone's porch on a donkey. Uh huh. What's well, I didn't go anyway. on the porch on the donkey, amigo. I just rock up here and walk up here, and I, now I get harassed by this uh, by the loud mouth gringo over there. Yeah, he, he does have a loud mouth for you. you All I want to do is come and shop, amigo, but no. Sometimes apologies no, just the go a long way. Say, huh? the, no, the problem is that you haven't apologized to anyone, even if the law has dealt with you on an individual basis. You haven't said sorry to anybody. I'm not sorry for anything, amigo. That's the problem. That's why you're going to get shot one day. You apologize, okay. everyone. Everything will be fine. You know, you know I'd, be, I'd be nice to you. I'm going to take your pies. I could have taken everything else, but no. It's all right, amigo. You took my why horse when we had a call coming in. Why did you take a pies? I, I was hungry. You could have asked yeah, for I would have given you one if you asked. You didn't have to steal them. That's fine. You're welcome to do so. 
Just if you could leave the doctors and everyone else alone, please, and apologize, that would be appreciated. I think getting yeah. them to apologize Don't harass is doctors. Lost Very big fine. Lots and lots of pesos. I mean, lots and lots. Yo, Panda. Like 40,000 pesos. Have you harassed doctors? Yo, Mrs. Phenom. Hello, boy. You don't want that, do you? I just want the loudmouth man. Oh, I think lots of people want the loudmouth man. Well, if he apologizes to you, you apologize to him. What do you think of that? I didn't do anything to him, amigo. I will make him happy. And he might even let you in his gun store. Yeah, it won't be his gun store for long, amigo. Look, let's say one of that? us had been robbing a lot of Mexican people of horses and being rude to them and Why this and that. Rob Mexican and then we go roll up into a town in Mexico. You wouldn't you wouldn't be too surprised if we didn't receive such a warm welcome, right? Oh, amigo, you know, uh, you know, you do your prison time in Mexico and we let you go. We have to... What the, what? amigo? Oh, what the fuck is that? The fuck I come back to? Oh, it's fuck. Oh, hey, Walt. Oh, oh. The fuck is going on? Amigo, shot wasn't me doing the Somebody crime. lassoed one of the people and just ran off with him and then shot out of fire. Was it the marshal that got lassoed? I don't know. I'm not part of this, amigo. This ain't me. You both okay? Hey, you, Governor. Hola, it is, son. Hola Mr. White Cloud. You, uh, you got a second, Mr. Amigo? Son, not right now. We got a, we got a bit of a shootout happening. How about we wait for this to be dealt with, and then, uh, then I can chat with you, son. Uh, they were, I don't know who it was, but somebody got lassoed who was standing Hello. in a big group of all the lawmen and everything, and then oh, they got dragged down the street, saw. and then oh, shot out of fire. How are you doing? Uh, well, it was good until Looks I like just nobody saw my fucked up sure. just get yanked away. Looks like nobody else got hurt, thank God. That's shocking. Yep. Yeah, what's going on? We're probably going to have to treat that in a minute. They were shooting and you just ran away from much me. As much as I might not like someone in the moment, no one deserves that. Exactly. Well, make sure, sure you stay in. Stand with you or not. Yeah, just make sure I need one well, person with me at all times. <laughs> Hi, Miss Cynthia. Well, that a bit oh, oh, sorry, Miss Hard Up. Yeah, no, uh, okay. uh, yeah, just was doing good until that moment, but uh, how about yourself? Oh, yeah, just uh, doing the last bit of yep, training. Yep, having people um, on your porch. Hoping to get an assessment done this evening. I don't know. Oh, what the I, fuck is I going on? Hey. And then I'll be able to... Uh, what the fuck is going on? on my own and I don't want no more fucking bullshit well, in town. I, fuck. I know you've definitely got in you to get it done, but how you feeling? Yeah, confident. From That's, what, yeah. That's what we need. That's the mentality you gotta have. Yeah. yeah. Can you get the loud mouth gringo to shut his mouth, please? So when are you Sorry, doing mate. in uh, Valentine this evening? No, the loud well, mouth I was looking the for the uh, Texas Good Ranger, though. but apparently oh, yeah. he was uh got his uh got the little hands full apparently. Oh. Apparently, mm -hmm. I came at a bad time, Marshall. which seems to yeah, be yeah. There's a, a lot of people here. Excuse me, it's hot. I might need to go quickly deal with this, but I'll uh, I'll, I'll come and say, uh, you know, good luck, cheer on you for your uh, your, sure. your exam. Good. I think it's best if we stay around for a, a few minutes longer in case something yeah. goes wrong. I'm going all right, Panda. I'm looking forward to the next week going by quickly. I don't know, Battle Tank. I I was... By the time I turned to have a look, it was all just so much happening. I have no idea what I was looking at. I can't believe it's quiet all of a sudden. I 
howdy. I'm doing well, how are you? I think we've spoken before, haven't we? Rocky, that's right. How you been? Yep, what are you doing to keep busy? Oh, yeah, fair enough. Yeah, well, you popped in at the, I guess, ideal time for saying hi to people. Valentine is very busy all of a sudden. A lot of people just standing around. I am down, though. <laughs> No, I know. You're pretty well behaved. That's but we like to linger around when there's a lot of people because inevitably someone could get somebody gets hurt. You know, being doctors, best thing we can do is respond respond very quickly. Really? Oh. Where? When was that? Was that today? No, nah, no, nah, we could go. Damn, you you doing all right? Who's putting things in? Yeah, things in yeah. Who's slipping things in my pocket? Yeah, I want to know the you? same thing. But yeah, hey, sure. I might catch the train again. I'll be back a bit later. Darkness. <laughs> Yeah, no worries. Well, I'll be around for a while, so you might see me again. And hopefully on good terms and not you getting injured or anything like that. Oh, yes, my uh, Mexican uh, fella. Easy, oh, is this one or the one down there? Oh, yes. I'm gonna go have a bar. Good to help you. He seems like a nice man. Big horse with big boots. Oh, Whoa! Oh, oh, damn it! Persephone! Louise, are you okay? Oh. Persephone. Yeah. I... Sorry, Louise. Oh. I was just... Yeah. That was probably my own fault. Oh, I'm gonna go take a bath. Hey. Where's my hat gone? Calm down, Percy. Ugh. I'm surprised she managed to turn around and do that while she was hit. <laughs> Those reins are stretchy. A lot of people in Valentine. Yeah, it gives me this uneasy feeling. Mm-hmm. Oh, I think your horse is looking for someone to kick. I hope she kicks that little fella who keeps stealing my horses and stuff. Yeah, he's a bit rude. He is rude. He doesn't seem to understand. People ain't gonna forgive him or let him in places until he apologizes. It seems like he's been harassing everyone in the town. Separate occasion. Yeah. Gee, I wonder why people don't want you around if you steal their stuff and steal their horses. And right? Act like a jerk. But you know me. I'll forgive if somebody says sorry. Yeah, but he's just shown no willingness to try and mend bridges at all. Mm -hmm. Well, that's fine. If he doesn't say sorry next time, I'm not gonna hesitate in shooting him in the toe. <laughs> I'll look the well, other actually, way. I did say I was going to be less reckless today. Maybe, maybe I shouldn't shoot people in the toes. Moderation is key. All right, you t you tell me. You'll be like Cynthia. It's time to shoot him in the toes, and I'll do it. Okay. Bye. All right. Cool. I'll gauge Think the I'll situation. I just heard a big old hi. What the fuck? You feeling better, Louisa? Yeah, nice. I apologize yeah. for that. Percy is, Percy is learning. Oh, well, that's okay. He's moving closer to my horse. You see that? He inch closer. I'm just gonna put myself between him and my. Yeah. <laughs> Ready to lasso anyone who may get on that horse. Mm. Uninvited.
Ba, 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 ba. I got a new pistol. Um, oh, what'd you get? One of my, another pistol, a volcanic one. Oh! Just one of my friends. Yeah, they weren't using it, so they gave it to me. Oh, give me a look. Said it was better than the. Oh, yeah. Oh, neato. Yeah. That uh, that trick wheel we've been shown yesterday, the quick find from the hip. Can you do that with that one? Uh, I haven't tried it yet. I actually haven't shot it yet, so hopefully it'll work. Oh, oh, well, we'll maybe on the ride to the next spot. We can, we can all find a quiet spot to, and you can practice on a tree. Yeah, yeah, that'd be good. Does the governor disappear, does he? Nope, he's having a chat to Mr. Golden the shop. He's not very happy. I'm tempted to say we'll go back on patrol, but I feel like as soon as we leave Valentine, something's gonna happen. Oh, yeah, know. I feel like we should. Stay it happens to me every time. But like, the other day, I said, oh, "Okay, we're gonna move on from Valentine." And Ten minutes later, we have to come back anyway. Oh, we can. Sure, you'd be right. We yeah. wait a little bit longer. I might actually go grab just yeah. some more rifle ammunition while we're here. Yeah, that's a wise idea. I'll be right back. <laughs> Fuck no. Well, Think no, might no. be considered bad, especially when it's not even threatening. Good conversation there, Governor. Have a good day. Uh, welcome to Gold's Gun, sir. How may I help you? Oh, I was just buying just some rifle ammunition. Thank you, Paul. Buying some rifle ammunition? How are you doing, by the way, George? Uh, I'm doing all right. Just uh, I'm on a bit of a leave of absence from the law department, so I'm uh, it's, uh, sort, of, sort of falling into running security for the doctors just while they've been having a bit of trouble lately. Yeah, that's fair enough. Yeah, people have been having a lot of trouble lately. I just got my stuff robbed at Mount Sean just last night. Really? Did you get a good look at them? Uh, decent look at them. Yeah, I'm having them. a fucking nap. I got bad. issues in my head. I'll, I'll be back. Sure. What, they take again? Uh, they took my, uh, 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 they took my bolt action. Uh, I do have the serial number if you do want to make a report on it. I haven't had the chance yet. Oh, you better run them back by Hawk, because I might not be sure. back in the office for another week. Um, do you need yeah, me to that's all good, anything? sir. That's all good. So I can be more helpful on a bit of... I better get back to the yeah, doctors, but uh, I hope things get better. I will keep them safe, and uh, I, think, I hope yeah, everything goes all right. I'll, I'll do my best. I'll see you next time. That, I'll see you next time. Uh, may or maybe not be in my head. <laughs> um, she'll be in a bit later. Fuck. I mean, it's kind of Yeah. You mind watching my horse while I go and get a drink and something on the saloon? Me? Yeah, just keep an eye on Persephone here because some people like to steal things. Consider it done. All right, appreciate it. Okay. You wanna pat Persephone? Oh! God damn it. Oh my God. Uh, Persephone just doesn't like me. Is it the purple? Oh, I think maybe just not liking me at the moment. <laughs> Henry's Henry's been replaced, Rando. Oh! Persephone! <laughs> ah! Oh no! <laughs> oh no. Oh, it's 
wanted to aim next to his head just to spook him. I didn't expect him to turn into it. No. Where'd he go? I got you. I got you, girl. Let's get you back to Cynthia. Guess who's getting extra morphine tonight? Oh god. One minute. What oh, I saved it. Oh, it's fine. Did he I got try it. Again? He did. Louise and I gave chase, and then I don't know where he went, but I found it down by the river. Oh, thank the Lord. She's all right. I just alerted the law. I better go tell him. What I swear, I turned my back for Louis seconds. Louisa kept the road across the bridge. I think that she's coming back now. All right. But yeah, I, I figured he might go down, try and cross the river. No sign of him. He's definitely coughing a bullet from you next time. Mm. It, uh, yeah, Persephone kicked Louisa again, then started to run down the street, then kicked me, and so the Mexican fella took that as his opportunity to jump on her and ride off. Louisa jumped on as well, but he kicked her off. Uh, Thanks, have any leads? Any need of help? Some help? I'm sure we can help. Well, you. got the horse back. He, uh, his horse is in the grave now, so we gotta go back. I'm sorry, Cynthia. It's not dead. Nah. It's just inside. It's just in the grave pit. So I found it. I found Persephone down That's by the river. It's all good, Louisa. Yeah. Sorry that Persephone job. kicked. Still, uh, Doctor's horse. Funny, because it kicked him. For yeah, a... this is the second time he's done it to me now. He did it to me yesterday in St. Danny as well. That's very nice of him. The East Law ended up picking him up, and they let him go shortly after. Okay. Well, you like you like where his donkey is at the moment. You put it in the grave, didn't you? Yeah. It's alive. <laughs> it's well, it is a small donkey. It'd fit in there. It's sitting there. Marshall, sir. Let's get her hitched back up. Yeah, it's good to see them. Yeah. Howdy. Oh, hey, nice hello, George. Howdy. 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 Oops, sorry, 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 sorry. Oh, oh, oh good. Oh, oh. Sorry, Percy. That must have been scary getting kidnapped. Horse nipped. Poor thing. Let's 
clean that stink off you. Why do all your horses like kicking everyone? She's a baby. Baby? <laughs> She's learning. She's a baby. She's, you know, we can be in my head for a moment. But also, she might have learned some bad habits from Henry in the stable overnight. <laughs> yeah, I think you're right. Yo, Battle Cat. She's calm down. Come on, hitch. Damn. Ow. Not working. Hitch, damn. It. I'm stuck. She's too no, big. Percy. Percy, you're too big. Maybe back it up. Oh. I got it. I got it. Well, close enough. She'll be fine. <laughs> she's just the she's the size of a grizzly bear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Might be bigger than a grizzly bear, actually. Probably kick a grizzly in the face with no issue. Mhm. Mm she should learn to be kicking the people who keep stealing horses. Yeah, it would be nice. I've seen her kick Louisa Don't twice you stop kicking. today. Don't you stop. Yeah, you point your ass that way. So, why are all the law and the government and everyone gathered here? <laughs> Who we knows? Know? Didn't. One of them want to have a chat right, with you? Uh, yeah, Lou, Lou wanted to have a quick chat. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'll go see what the governor and wolf, see if there's anything I need to be aware of. Yeah, might be a good idea. I'll just go check in. I'll be right back. But other than that, that's all they're dealing with. Mr. Hughes! Howdy, sorry to interrupt, fellas. It's just while I'm while I'm around here escorting the doctors, is there anything I can be doing to help? Well, son, I thought you were taking some leave. Well, I'm taking leave from the law department, but I've sort of fallen into escorting the uh, the doctors as security. I was security. But it's, it's, I'm glad you're doing that, son. I literally just put out a... So I got, you know, got some bulletin boards put up of, uh, you know, my stance on all these people, you know, abusing our doctors and... Taking advantage of them, so oh, good mind. Good putting that on, put on that yourself, son. Good minds think alike. So I've been doing that the last few nights, and um, I just I thought, you know, it just felt like the right thing to do. Well, look, son, if you ain't on duty, there's nothing I can ask of you to do. But if you know, as I said, you know, you're more than happy to, you know, give information, do anything you can to the sheriffs, and they'll get what they need to do. But oh yeah, oh. no, I uh, when I went on my leave absence, I I updated Harkness, and I said, you know. If if I learn anything, I'll tell them and uh, and yeah, no, I'm just it just it's it's part of that soul searching. So you know, I'm taking a break while you know I'm looking after important people. So it's it it's good middle ground. No, son, that sounds like this is very admirable of you, son. Oh, it's it's good though. They uh, uh like uh, Mr. Selger, one of the doctors, he he actually uh gives me some of his pay, and they uh they share me some share with me some matches and cigarettes. So it's a uh, and and they they you know. It's a good chance to get to know all the doctors, so it's I guess it's part of that, uh, you know, uh, community enrichment. Sounds like me, he was uh, part of your soul search, and is that getting a little extra money? Oh no, no, so I, I, I... he extra, he extra pocket searching. His pockets are empty now that he ain't in the law. He's like, well, fuck, I ain't gonna ride around with y'all for free. No, 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 they offered. Looks like you're finding a hand to hold as well. Yeah. Oh no, yeah, well, it's platonic. It's I, dipping. No, it's platonic. It's we're yeah, just I'm good sure, friends. I'm sure, Mr. We are just good friends. I can no, assure no, no, you. I've of seen the both the two little pinky fingers touching. I, yeah, I don't know. Trust me, trust me. We didn't want to bring that up, but I'm glad he did. We was on both on the. Oh, uh, partner. Look, sir, I take <laughs> I take the law and doctor relationship very seriously. I'm, yeah, I'm sure, sure you do. I'm sure you do when <laughs> when you are law. But uh, you know you're on vacation, so I guess you're on vacation. Well, I can tell you that every time that I've been with the doctors, nothing's happened to them. So 
I'd like to think it's healthy. That's good. Yeah, well, it sounds like it, son. Good. Look, all I ask, son, is when when the time comes, you know, you step up and you send me an invite to that wedding. <laughs> 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 it's not like that. So she's uh, we'll have free security because we'll be betting. Yeah, we can do free security for y'all. So we'll yeah, the Rangers do free security for y'all on your so, wedding. No, she she ain't about that at all, and I, I fully respect it, and I'm good. I'm fully at peace with it. I'm just it's just yeah, good to I'm have made a good so. friend. Um, she actually uh, uh, we went hunting in tall trees yesterday, and uh, I got mauled by a bear. And if she hadn't been there, uh, you might not be speaking to me now. So. <laughs> You, do you remember speaking to me um, uh, after that event, Potter? I do not. I wait, remember right. waking up in the Blackwater doctor's office, but that's yeah, about it. Yeah, yeah. She had to put you there too because uh, <laughs> you, you basically she she told she went through the A to Z on the medication she gave you, partner, and uh, oh. she was still she was still insisting that she give you a little little top up. And uh, partner, you were you was as high as a kite. It was it was it was it was, <laughs> it was a good sleep. I'll tell you that much. I bet. It was. Bet. It was a. Those beds are mighty comfortable. Yeah. Did well though. You held. You held up pretty well for for a good while too. You were fighting it. Well, but, she um, she would have put down that bear and then kept me stitched up out in the field. So it, you know these doctors are getting trained really well. I'm so I'm w literally witnessing it firsthand. I've seen some amazing communication, leadership, just initiative from the doctors, and uh, I feel like it might be a blessing in disguise. I might be able to bring some of that back to the law department because. Like, the doctors are acting more like a unit than the fucking department. It's funny you mention that. We were literally just talking about that. Oh? Well, I don't know, I don't know if you've got my telegram, but we're uh, going to be having a meeting on Thursday to uh, kind of uh, address a kind of some, some issues that I've been seeing and let you boys address some issues to me. So, uh... uh who, who's, who's, who's invited? Well, I was, all the heads. It's a, so basically, it's the two heads of each department. So, got you know, Marcus here. Yourself and yeah. yeah. From, so from you, your you're, you're, I've already sent you out a telegram regarding it. So, uh, so it'll be Harkness and myself from the west. Uh, right. there on the Thursday, but uh, I'm sure Marcus will fill me in. It will be yeah. fucking word by word, Ranger. You, you know. I'll be I'll be sending out some uh you know some uh you know minute meetings regarding it. So. Okay. I'm hoping awesome. uh, it's be you know very very helpful for everyone involved. I can't yeah. promise anything, but I am most I'm quite positive I will be available for not only the Thursday meeting but also Taco Tuesday. Oh, Taco Tuesday! God. Uh, Taco Don't Tuesday's even more Don't likely. Even started Thursday. Something might come up, and if I do miss it, I do apologize. But I will make so every as long as one of y'all are there. That's all that matters. I just need at least one of the people from that department. In that mean, I don't even. Care. I, I obviously I'd prefer it being the heads, but if it ain't the heads, I just need someone represented who can pass on that information. Can uh, is, is uh, Lady Lewis still there? Yeah, Miss Lewis, so Miss Lewis, yep. we, we haven't seen her for, for quite some yeah, time. Now. So as far as I'm aware, they've been taking some leave. I've been aware of it. They've uh, you know, I've got currently, you know, I've told the under sheriff to step up and take the responsibility. So I've asked the, the under sheriff to come and uh, then second in command from land. So. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, so who's okay. the highest ranking official in the West right now? In the West? Yeah. Well, technically Dallas Walker, but in 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 the sheriffs, um, you're looking at uh, wait, you mean the West or the East? The, uh, the sorry, the West. The West. You got Mr. Hughes and uh, Mr. Harkness. All right. So you Hughes been on technical leave, so Harkness is essentially okay. Correct. So, and just a reminder, boys, you know, uh, you know, we we were technically meant to be doing a vote, you know, that's essentially. What we, that's, this, what, that's what we all thought as well. That's why. And I, that's yeah. what we're going to be talking about in the meeting. It's just okay. we had to postpone it just due to some, uh, you know, some other things that need to be addressed first before we can uh, get to that. So. All right. Okay. Okay, because the it's the boys the boys just need uh yeah just to know what's going on. I yeah you you know anyway, partner. You know it's uh, and then yeah then we can we can move on. So how long do you think uh, before what what is it what is it going to be? Is it is it going to be a vote what, system or is it's it gonna it's going to be a vote? So it goes to the community. Community you know put in who they want their sheriffs to be. But it, what it'll what it'll essentially be is I'll let the sheriffs come to me. Let them know. Let them let them know to me or one of the marshals. 
basically mm -hmm. they they want to take responsibility the sheriffs they'll you know get the rundown saying you know these are what we expect of a sheriff and you know the responsibilities because as you can tell you know and a good example is what's happening right now we've lost two sheriffs that are you know they're just due to not being on and you know things start getting displa displacement when they're not around right oh, both this sides is, both sides of the moment are exactly are displaced exactly it's and a that's a fucking mess and i've had to it's make critical you know, as sorry it's critical as well stuff goes missing people take stuff because no authority it, it's uh it's a pretty uh there's so much catching up to do um yeah. in a week it's it's fucking beyond a joke yeah, so um, I, I stand, boys. It's building now. It's now. It's, it's then rebuilding back to the community as well, um, and, you know, because you know it's a lot of things. You know uh, that I've seen. You know, with with no disrespect to the to the deputies over the east, but uh, you know some of those things. Uh, you know, they're going to tarnish the uh, department. Um, you know. Oh, I'm very aware, boys. I'm very aware. I've already had words with them. Um, in saying that, um, look to answer your actual, you know, your question. Yeah. Um, my aim is to be, you know, within the next two weeks. Um, within, I'm hoping. Um, it's only going to be if things, you know, if there's other things that need to be addressed more urgently. And, like, a lot of this also comes to numbers, right? So I, a lot of it's hard to judge numbers because we've had a random fluctuation of, like, people come, people go, people on, people not on. You know, I, I can't I can't work without without, you know, the, you know, without the numbers being able to make to to make better bigger decisions so i need people to you know show that they're committed and people to be on there and doing the job um to make to make those bigger decisions so um and saying that because it's, it's experience as well you know because we you know t to trust someone in that position uh you know they, they do I'm have sorry, to have here's the doctors may be going if you want to oh. go with them yeah, I'll just, I'll just finish with a. I should know my availability by the uh, by within the next seven days. No problem, son. Fingers crossed. Thanks, um, yeah, I don't mean to be, you know, letting down the department or anything, but I'm dealing with a lot of stuff. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah so you're allowed. You're allowed to take breaks, son. Yeah. Yeah. No worries, gentlemen. Well, if there's anything, if let me know if there's anything else, but I'll get back to making sure these doctors can do their job without yeah, people yeah, being shit. Yeah, you yeah, do yeah. what you, you need to do, let us know we can help you, partner, you know? Fucking A, you know? Appreciate y'all. Uh, I'll see you later. I'll we see got you, partner. Oh, thanks, Battle Cat. I watched a lot of movies, a lot of TV shows. I'm a bad driver. Sorry, we're dealing with a call. No, no, they they gave me the heads up. I'm I'm ready. I'm sorry. Right. It just it turned into a bit more than a quick That's hello. That's right. We're going to Blackwood. Okay. It was good. It sounds like there's a, 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 a heads of the law departments meeting Thursday night where many oh, yeah. things will be addressed. Oh, hold on, hold on. Let me check. All right, they put out a call. Man down, then they put out a call. No help for pride anymore. I'm turning around. Fuck that. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't want to travel in the storm. So annoying. Let me just hop off the horse so I can fix this in my carrier pigeon. <laughs> nice of them to let us know, I guess. Oh, what? Dumb hats in the east? <laughs> no, what the <laughs> Oh. They can't make up their mind. Realize the local doctor, um, Annoyed doctors on route? Doesn't actually work. Alright, Blackwater it is. Let's go.
Well, I reckon with the next GTA and the next... Well, hopefully there'll be another Red Dead game. I... 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 I imagine we may see some level of the RP side of things available on console in the future, I think. Um, with Rockstar acquiring the, um, the 5M and the Red M services, I wouldn't be surprised if they're looking at having, like, making, like, uh, a simple version of custom, like, lobbies for that on console. Not as not as in depth as the PC version, but I reckon there might be something. Well, that's what I would want. If I was the head of Rockstar, that's what I'd want to be exploring anyway. I'd be like, we need to make sure the single player is amazing as always. We need to make sure the online mode's got everything people expect, and then let's look at introducing like a simple RP version of the online mode for people that are interested on console that don't have PCs. That's what I would do. I reckon so, Dub. Like, they could go, you know, a, like, another prequel. Or they could do... Why is it Hang on. Um, it's, it's straight ahead. You don't, know, listen, don't watch me. Yeah. They could do a game about, uh, you know, Jack Marston. Or, um, uh, what's the... What was the... What was the lady? Who was the lady with them in Red Dead 2? Um, she becomes a badass. Like, she gets saved at the start of the game, and then by the end of the game, she's a badass. What's, what's her name again? Um, oh, I'm struggling to remember the names. Careful now. I won't mess up this time. <laughs> well, we lie. Did I mess up? No, yeah. right. So there's a track where the train bridge is. No, there's this track here. This is right. Yeah. Yeah, you want the, uh, there's like a, a, a gap at the train gap. So okay. next time. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, what? No, I remember, yeah, th yeah, there's one there, one here, and then there's and then there's the safe, safe one further down. That's right. Yeah, three, right? Mm -hmm. Just wish they'd make a proper bridge or path. Yeah, yeah. Like, where does all the tax money go? Into the governor's tequila stair. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know whether to get him a gift, but... Please don't give him alcohol. No. Yeah, I've been trying not to. <laughs> I worry for his health. Workers just don't like this track. Oh. oh, she did. I see it. Hi, Dolores. Hey, how are you? Hi. I'm alright. Sorry for the confusion. I'm just as annoyed as you at that. That's that's alright. Gentlemen, yeah, it's the second time. Just had one for bloody roads as well. Um, we got a shotgun injury to the uh, upper uh, shoulder here on the uh, right hand side. Would you like some assistance? Uh, looks pretty straightforward to be honest. He's talking, so 
Not too much oh, blood. Always a good sign. Yeah, the bullet didn't. Uh, bullet's still intact. No fragmenting. This one would be pretty straightforward. Uh, All right. I know it's a bit painful. All right. Just a bit of pain whilst I clean this up, just so I can have a look at that wound. Yeah. All right. Let's get in there and have a real good look. All right, it's just sitting in the muscle there, the pec muscle. So this one will be uh, coming straight out, no problems. Beautiful. So I'm going to live. You've, you've become quite the regular patient. Yeah, I just treated Mr. Little not 30 minutes ago. Uh, I'm about to come for a ride I have become boys. fairly well acquainted right. with Mr. Little. Yes. Mm -hmm. Wait, who's that? Dr. Wheel. Well, we have our doctor's reports, Mr. Little. I can see everything that's been happening. Oh I, haven't, I already have another one to put in on him. I haven't put it in yet. Wait, another one? Mr. Little, you need to take more care for yourself because we're going to have to start charging you. I'm happy to pay you guys do a good job. $25 a time? Can you afford that? I, I will. I'll pay you anything as long as you keep me alive. Mr. Little, is it? Hubert Little. No, Clyde. That's Clyde. This is Clyde. Mr. Little, oh. do you have a spare cigarette? I uh, don't think so. Oh really, God. George? Hey, really? I might, George. <laughs> do, you, do you think this is the most appropriate time for that? George, oh. I have a cigarette. What are you doing? I'm hey, just I'm keeping his mind off the pain. All right. You know what? It kept your mind off the pain so much, I got that bullet out and you didn't even notice. Oh, Jesus. They, that I'm one's hurting. for free. <laughs> It's hurting now. Hey, oh, you big baby, it's almost just, over. Uh, ask everyone a favor and just uh, back out of this room real quick. Except Dolores and the big fella at the table. <laughs> Do you want that cigarette? <laughs> it was half, half serious, half joke. No, I know. I know what you're like. I'm trying to calm the mood down. Oh, it's fairly calm. We just got to remind people that when they're frequent patients that, you know, usually if you threaten to make them pay, they stop getting hurt so much. <laughs> Do you want a cigarette? Only from Mr. Little. All right. But it's not serious. I don't need one right now. I got plenty from yesterday. It's just every time right now we show up to a, a case, I haven't been able to get my hands dirty. <sighs> Much quieter here than Valentine. I'm itching to get my hands into a wound and start suturing. Well, we can go up to tall trees if you really want. I would rather not have to stitch you back together again. But you have no idea how much my hands are shaking. I'm surprised that the stitching is straight. Oh, you did fine. Out of everybody that I treat, I'd rather it not be you. Well, I'm I'm still standing. No, no harm done. That that's not the point. The point is, never mind. It's fine. Hello, boss. I don't know what's been happening with the call-outs this evening, but they've been a little bit all over the place. Yeah, we had a, we've had a few that we've shown up and then other people have been there or they've just been re-pinged them a couple times, sent out too many pigeons. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's been a bit of a mess, but we were just in Valentine as well, where the governor and everybody is as well, so wait for something uh, happened. Ah, yeah, yeah, by, yeah, yeah, governor, I'm aware Deputy of something. Governor, Deputy Marshal, Marshal, everybody. Yeah, there was a situation in Valentine. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Yep, yep. All right, I have to leave you. I've got pigeons in my ear that need to talk to me, so um, That's I'll right. leave you to it. We got right, the good, good to see you all. Good to see, see you too. too. Evening. Those evenings. Where did my damn horse go? Even. Yep. Yep, good. Oh, here comes trouble. 
I thought she was gonna Louise, knock Louise look out! out. <laughs> <laughs> no! I need to look out too. You, you got me square in the face as well. Hey, George, the person in a blue coat, red mask, that's one of the people that took me hostage the other day. Where? Standing behind my horse. That's the, that's the sort of outfit that the people took me hostage. He just ran inside. Is he still inside? I think so. I might have gone to have a bath. I think some people got taken hostage. Somebody got taken hostage and a fella... Howdy, is anybody in the bath? Anybody in there? Nope. Maybe upstairs. He must, he must have got away. No one upstairs, I'm afraid. Probably free now, mate, if you need a quick chat. Oh, no, no, I'll, I'll go grab him. Okay. Oops, sorry. Did you find him? No, I think he got out the back door or something. Oh. There is a back door there. Ooh, some people are slippery. Yeah, we just want to make sure that everybody's seen the latest notices from the governor about leaving doctors beat. Oh, absolutely. You know, um, it just laws. People break laws all the time. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, but well, these are doctors good. that it ain't doing nothing but trying to keep people healthy. Of course, of course. Oh, we'll keep everybody healthy, even the posse's in the. So it's well. one thing to already be a piece of shit. But to be the whole damn steaming pile is another thing. Yeah, unfortunately, some people are like that, mate. It's just the way mm -hmm. the world works. And that's why we it's have a big concrete there. box ready for them. Absolutely, I agree with you. Well, shall we uh, head out of town? Sounds good. Hey. Portal found out. We haven't looked on strawberry at all today. Probably should do that. Oh, okay. my favorite. Sounds like a plan. Joseph and I uh, spent the night at the doctor's office there because it's the most peaceful place. We were like, oh God, it's been chaos everywhere else. We need to go clock off for the evening. I'm like, we're going to camp in the strawberry doctor's office. It is nice and quiet nice there. Good idea. Nothing bad has been happening there lately. As we were getting ready to hit the hay, we were at the telegram office in Valentine and we saw some people rolling up with masks and stuff. We're like, we're out. We're going right to Strawberry. <laughs> this is the, the night that everything happened with Caldera and all that too. We were fed up.
I was just saying before, Louisa, every time we've been showing up to call, we haven't been able to treat anybody. I'm itching to get my hands dirty. Never thought I'd miss suture or nothing. You want me to give you a pop quiz? All right. You uh, come upon a scene and somebody puts their gun to your head and tells you to, uh, to uh, fuck off. What do you do? Fuck off. <laughs> That's the correct answer. Uh, would you do anything else following that? Uh, I'd probably wait until it was clear. Um, and then see if the patient is still still there. Mm -hmm. And it is at your discretion. You can call the law if you like, depending on the situation. Oh, yeah, sure. But uh, yeah, oftentimes I find it's probably better to sit back, pull out your binoculars and hide and see if, if you can move in once they leave. But mm -hmm. sometimes they, they, they won't let you get close enough. Yeah. All right, you show up to a situation. They put uh, a bunch of guns on your head and they tell you to uh, revive and assist their their hostage that they have. What do you do? Uh, revive the hostage? Who is their toad? Who is I'm told with all the guns on me? Good. Yep. Now, they're also rushing to carry your patient. What do you do? Still try and uh, keep composure and do what I can. Um, Yo, snaps. How you doing? One thing you can do is try and reason with him and say, "Hey, we need to take an extra few minutes to treat him properly. Otherwise, he's gonna die on your watch. You're not gonna be able to have a, a live hostage. You need to give us a time. You can. You can. Yeah. Usually, they are fine to argue back with as long as you assess the situation and not get too. Just try not to get bitchy with still, them. Still, yeah. I, I guess it still uh, depends on the situation and how hostile they are. I always get a telegram from you, Louisa, and then I see you before I see the telegram. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. But I right. just, uh, similar. Right. A gentleman anyway. steps in a fire. You have uh, arrived on the scene. How do you, uh, triage his wound? Um. Well, if he's. Okay. Uh. Depending how bad the burn is. If it's a bad burn, uh, because he's been on fire. Have to, um... All right, let's uh, say that it is a second level burn, so not surface tissue, but there is some uh, exposed under tissue. Okay. Uh, aloe vera and then probably a compression bandage. All right, if possible, I would actually take them to the closest run and source of water, like a river. Yeah. And put them in there and douse it in the cold water. Oh, right, yeah. Um, then I would go through the wound and see if any of it needs to be removed, because once a piece of flesh is dead, you can't you can't get it healed up. Okay. So yep. things need to be excised. Because if you're removing something from a patient, it's called excision. Excision. Okay. Or excising, excised, all those sort of variations. Mm -hmm. 
And when we cut off dead flesh from people in like cases of frostbite and fire burns, uh, it's excision. Also, fun fact, if you remove a parasite from somebody, that's also an excision. If you have to cut it out. Neat. So it's not necessarily that you're removing a piece of them. You're removing foreign bodies as well. Okay. So you can use the terms interchangeably. Um, after I rinse it in cold water for a long time and assess for an excision, I would then apply an aloe balm. Sometimes you can apply a honey and aloe mix. Okay. And then... Uh, compressive bandage obviously lots of cocaine you know in that in a case of a serious burn like that they they hurt like hell so i would uh try and go for an intravenous would cocaine. you oh okay yep intravenous being a you inject it right into their bloodstream like you would when you're doing saline oh right but uh, yeah. it's like yep. the liquid form of cocaine or a uh, laudanum which is the liquid form of opium oh sure um, all right, let's let me see here. I want to. You probably won't know this, but this is just a test of your um, knowledge of anesthetic. Now, if you had to knock out a patient for surgery, what would you use? Oh, uh, yeah, no, I don't believe uh, I know that one. It hasn't come up. Chloroform or Cl ether? Chlor oh, ether or chloroform? Ether or chloroform? Okay. Uh, both of them are chemicals that give off a gas, so when you apply it under someone's nose, they, they tend to pass out. Right. Oh, let me check that. They're more likely to be, you know, doctor office, <laughs> surgical place well, sometimes you need to use out. it in the field. Okay, yeah. Good to know. Seriously, back in Blackwater? If it's the same person, can we charge him already? Take us to black water. It's um, it's going all right tonight, Snaps. It's nice just um, spending time with the doctors, just doing more security escort of them while Hughes is on leave from the law department um it's it's good in a way hey, where it, yeah uh if somebody got bitten by a wolf on the arm how would you treat it i'd stab the wolf <laughs> exactly right <laughs> um it's good because it's like it's good to get away from the law stuff for a bit and then like actually get to get to uh other Areas of the country, talk to other people that you normally wouldn't talk well, to. I didn't that was a um, yeah, it's it's a it's a nice change of pace. Keep riding. That was a scary animal noise. Keep going. There's a wolf noise. Straight ahead, Louisa. Just a straight ahead. There you go. Wait, were you feeding them? I did. Oh, sorry. I was just I yelling. I, was, I heard a spooky noise, Louisa. Keep going. I heard a spooky noise. The 70 was a little worn out, so we gave her some hay. Oh, that was an old. That was the one from the Lord. Should 
be right here. Where? Hello. Here, right here, apparently. Hello. Oh. 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 Oh, Mr. Little. Yeah. It's what me. What happened to you? Uh, well, since our last uh, interaction, I've been robbed and tied up. Well, I hate to say it, um, being tied up is not necessarily a medical problem. You would need to alert the sheriffs. Did they wound you? Were you injured? Uh, they kicked me. Yeah, but you, are you dying? Uh, no, no. All right, well. Oh, please okay. don't report this. I, I'm not going to report it. You got $10. Next time. Well, actually, yeah. Money, please. I don't have any money. They left me with $1. Oh, well, what do you have in your pocket? Got any? Do you have hay? Have. Uh, so you can feed our horse. On. They gave me some popcorn. I'll take the popcorn. All right. Done. Uh, yeah. yeah. Usually, uh, when you get tied up, you can. Wait, uh, sixty-seven. You said. Wriggle out That's yourself right. later on. No, there's only one ten, thirty-two, and fifty-five. Give it any of That's fine. All right, there you go. There you go. Who got that? Uh, somebody did. Now, next time you're tied up or you have an altercation like this that don't require medical assistance, what are you gonna do? Uh, just sit here for the next three hours. No, no. You, you call the sheriff. The sheriffs? Yes. The same way you would alert a doctor, you alert sheriff instead. All right. Will do. All right. Cause, oh, you, yeah. you usually can wriggle out of the uh, bonds after some time, though. Yeah. But you are very lucky that uh, Dolores wasn't the one who showed up because she would have left you here to rock. All right, thank you very much. All right. It was Clyde well, Little, right? Stay safe. That's right. All right. Again, I can't get my hands dirty. No medical work today, apparently. We get a moment. Can we swing by a telegram? Of course. I won't be long. That's fine, you take your time. Um. Alexi. Right. Harkness has been made aware. Oh, of course. Then this time they were actually in, he, he was actually in the saloon. So we didn't have to go out there. No. Uh... Soon enough I'll be able to suit you somebody today. Goddamn. <laughs> Old trees is just up there. Yeah. Hey, nope. anybody, <laughs> anybody that wants to waste your time, just shoot them and then uh, fix them yourself. <laughs> Well, that is not yeah. I like the way that you think. Maybe just a quick incision into the, you know, somewhere that won't kill them, but uh, maybe Louisa needs some more practice, you know? That's right. That's right. <laughs> That's right. I was hoping to get more practice before my assessment. I'm like, oh. 
Nothing. Nothing. We'll have to consider that. <laughs> nah, we best be off. Not perfect. It's good to see you. So remember, if you want to keep it sexy, come see Alexi. I just did. I ain't got no money now. Tell your friends. If... The same All thing. Right. I will. That's what done you. Bye. Good to see you. Look a little bit better. To... Yeah, he does look a bit better. Ugh. I wanted to suit you, somebody. <laughs> Who's all that riding in? Oh, there's a Westlaw. Maybe. Hmm. Alright. Miss Louisa. Maybe the governor will get attacked by wolf skin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Louisa, somebody gets impaled on a tree branch. What do you do? And you roll up and they're still impaled, but... Oh, okay. Um... Alright, I guess I'll... I'll check that they're still alive, see if they're responsive, mm -hmm. um, and then uh, see if I can, I guess, easily remove the branch. Uh, right. We'll walk within. it back. We'll, we'll go through it step by step, I think. Okay. Uh, well, that's a bit first hard. off, you would approach the scene and seeing a poor fucker like that, you would establish that he's breathing. If he's breathing, give him an instant shot of uh, pain relief. Oh. Uh, yep. That has to be the worst. Sure. Uh, yeah. Then I would find somebody who can assist with holding them upright while I cut the branch and then we can lay them down. Yeah. Okay. Uh, then once we have them on the ground, you need to try your best to establish if the branch is holding anything together. Because, <laughs> like, a lot of the times when people get impaled, you have to leave them like that. Um, and then, sorry, that, that was Thought a that was conversation the ride pass. <laughs> uh, a lot of the times when people get impaled, even if it's by a knife, you, you're best off leaving the knife inside them. Oh, yeah. Because a lot of the times, the, the knife is holding them together, you know, pretty much, you know, it might be caught in the vessel, but it might be holding inside that vessel. Okay. Oh, they're coming back. Oh, no. Out it. Out it. Ew, George. Miss Wheeler. Howdy. Sorry to disturb you. Uh, do you mind if I have a quick private word with you one second? Uh, of course. Sorry, gentlemen. Uh, was and uh, Miss Hall, we won't, we won't be too long. No problem. How you doing, Ames? Yeah, I'm glad George. How you going? Yeah, just... No dramas with the doctors the last few nights while I've been around, which is good, so... Eh, that's good. Doing my part. 100% don't. Uh, I heard there was a little bit of commotion and such. Yeah. No, I've read the reports of what happened uh, well, a couple nights ago and everything like that. Uh, With doctors getting threatened business. and beaten? <laughs> I, it's just... Disgusting. Yeah, dog ain't going on. Not on my fucking watch. Well, as long as it's... As long as it stops, people continue doing it, then just, you know... And fuck it, send them to Cisco if they're gonna do that shit. I don't care if it's a misdemeanor or whatever, they just hit him with something harder and send him to Cisco. Yep. Now learn the hard way. Other than that, it hasn't been anyway. Yeah, well, I <laughs> I thought I would be doing a bit more, you know, relaxing and hiking and hunting and stuff on my yeah, leave of absence. But, time off. But yeah. yeah, the recent events of you know, it's just not happening. But you know, I wouldn't I wouldn't be able to sleep at night knowing I wasn't doing my part helping doctors in need. No, oh, no, well, that's fair. That's fair. Yeah, no, it, uh, yeah, as long as people are starting to behave, you know, that's amazing. Just need to give them a bit of a kick. No, we're, <laughs> we're on our way up. I don't even know who the gentleman was. Dallas, you know who the heck that was? The one that screamed out, Governor, your mother's a bitch. Oh, he's gone. Yeah, he's going to chuck a leak. Some, 
some jackass uh, yelled out that uh, governor your mom's a bitch and uh just just and now stop the carriage yeah yeah, yeah. Shit, yeah, I don't, and, uh, who the hell could that have been? Older, older voice, a bit gravelly. But... Gravelly older voice. Yeah. Huh. Anyway, we roped him up and he apologized. And then cut him loose, sent him on his way. Jesus. But, yeah. Nervous some people. Mm-hmm. Yeah, not good. But, uh... Yeah, need to... Kick, kick, kick a few people in the teeth, I think. <laughs> it does feel like that. I, I wonder what mm. I wonder what some of these parents are doing to raise their oh, yeah. raise people part like this. Me, part of me wants to let Marcus uh, the reins loose on him a little bit. Mm. Just let him take a few people to the tar pits and shit. Yeah, get them in the mines. Mm -hmm. Exactly. I feel so. for that. <laughs> you know. Just need, to, once again, people ain't respecting the badge. Yeah. But most of the time, they're the first people to complain about law being around. They're the first ones to say that you're not doing anything as soon as a small inconvenience besets upon them. Mm. You ever had Cowboy Coco? Uh, I'm not quite sure what Cowboy Coco is. That I'm assuming it's hot chocolate or something like that. Pretty much. Yeah. It's really nice. Oh, yeah. Well. Didn't see any one of the bunch of horses roll past, did you? Uh, yeah. yeah we did, um, uh, Marcus was, I think it was Marcus, the bar owner. They, they took the left fork just there. I think they might oh, the maybe fork. towards Four Trees or the, the ranch up that way. Okay, uh, thank you. Uh, uh, yeah. the strawberry or Valentine then. One of the group owns a strawberry gun. Are they, uh, so. being jackasses or something? Yeah, they stole someone's gun. Yeah. I think you it. Need me? Not particularly, there's already not. Like there's a lot well, of stay people. Stay safe, everyone. Yeah, See I, you around. I feel like there's <laughs> too much people. Ah, good sorry, I'll take up uh, your time you. and uh, Miss Hard. I, I, you know, again, I, I'm sorry I didn't get to catch up with you back in Valentine, but good luck. Uh, thanks, George. I, not that you need it. I'm sure you're part of flying colors. Yeah. Um, Cynthia's been uh, giving me pop quizzes on the. Howdy, ma'am. How are you? I feel uh, like uh, she has I'll a good head on her shoulders, so I think uh, oh, that's you'll great. Be, yes. You're in good hands. You take care of him, call Mr. Hughes. Pa pardon? No, Mr. Hughes. He had a frog in his. I uh, have just. God, I got. It's a. It's. It's Shake a. It's a hard G, call. sir. It's God, a hard no. G. I'm saying it from the call, you know. Yeah, you're going to say no, it's like you know, land and clear, sir. Uh, Mr. Hughes, just you might need to give it a bit of a hot tour and just get that lurgy out of there. Yeah. What does that mean? It happens what? to the best of us. No, uh, there we go. The French just it all a up. bit of a toi. <laughs> I mean, a little toi, are you saying? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Get it all out of there. Um, might need there to you go. Sorry look. about that. All right, well, if y'all need anything, you know where we'll be. All right. Yeah, I guess vaguely here around. You oh, haven't told us your yeah. location. You know where I, my, you know where my office is. <laughs> You're not often in your office. Every time I've been in there, you ain't there. Oh, well, that's I, true. You I do, I do have to go out and you know meet the people every now and then, but that's usually where I'll be. Yeah. No, sure, I'll believe it when I see tacos. it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Drop All right. my office to check. <laughs> All right, let's continue on. All right, ladies, okay. where are we heading? I'll take care. Uh, let's go, Valentine. All right. Um, sir? Oh, sorry, man. How can I help you? Hi, my name's Lou. Yeah, let's uh, head on, Louise. I'm just going to have a little private conversation oh. here with you. Sir, can riding. we uh, get okay. that uh, mask and gun down in the presence of the governor and the docks, please? I'm under the range, son. Right. I'm, uh, my mistake. It's okay. <laughs> Whoops, sorry. Can you see which way they all went? Uh, left at the fog. Thank you, sir. No worries. Ma'am, do you know who that man was? <laughs> hey, no, what's going on? No, left! Left of the fog! That's right! Left of the- Anyways, He doesn't seem that smart. Jesus Christ. Well, uh, meet- Meet your Valentine. We'll be riding alongside you. I'm just whispering in his ear. Don't you worry. You know it's serious when she rides on the back of my horse these days, Louisa. That's right. <laughs> yeah. 
governor was checking in on our deal. <laughs> Oh, he dear, right. why? What's By the way, he's, check, he's checking to make sure that I'm making sure you're coming back to work. Oh, really? I told him I'm I'm making every effort to be at the head of the department's like, meeting oh, Thursday. I really need to have him on the team. I'm just making sure that, you know, you're holding up your end of the bargain, Cynthia. I hope you saw that the billboards I put out there with all the information. And I said, yeah, great. It's a good first step. And he goes, what do you mean first step? I said, well, on the billboard itself, you wrote that there would be more to come. And he, he, was, he was like acting like he did enough already. I was like, nope. Well, look, I, I I just need to see how things go with with everything that's going on with me over the next week. Because my, my like schedule it. might be turned upside George, down. George, like I said, there's no pressure. If you quit your job and decided to be a permanent bodyguard or a train driver or whatever you want, that's up to you. I'm still getting what I need out of this bargain no matter what. I, I know, I know. I just, yeah, I told him that, you know, I just need... I should know more at the end of the week, and uh, and I will make every effort to be at the department's meeting this Thursday night. So if he asks again, just that's I'm sticking to that. It's okay. just okay. I need to see some changes, and it's you know it's not yeah. necessarily on the governor. It's it's just the the there's a lot of uh, weird attitudes and lack of training coming through from recruits and people that have come mm -hmm. from other counties and whatnot, and it's it's rocking the boat. No, I, I definitely know that. And, uh, and uh, it's just not on. My my training was quite strict, and there was a whole lot of things that we understood by the end of that. And if you didn't, you were out. Yeah. And uh, people well. shouldn't be coming into the law department without that foundation. And I'm, I'm frankly, I'm sick of it. I find it kind of strange that you're also out of sync when the med team is very in sync. No, I I, I mentioned that in before. I said the doctor's department is uh, acting more like a unit than the sheriff's department. Right. Well, I just wanted to keep you up to speed because you know I'm not going to put any pressure on you, but I'm going to tell you when he talks to me. I understand. No, I, you're a good friend, Cynthia. I appreciate everything you do. Like I said, you could you could quit your job tomorrow, and uh, I'd still be around. Oh, that's that's good to know. I just want to make it clear that uh, you know I, I'm not your friend because you're a lawman. I I know that. Yeah. Okay, I'm just making sure. Wait. I just want you to know that you have value beyond your job. You're my friend because you like getting invitations to fancy events. That, hey, that ain't accurate at all. What the hell? <laughs> I'm, you know, I, so I'm your friend because I need someone to practice sutra and you wear abs. <laughs> Yo, about eight hours slow. Louisa! Yeah. Dude, that so sounds fucking good, that dude. Branch out of somebody, you need to assess uh, which vessels have been impacted. Dude, if you share that in a Discord, tag me. So you probably should get a copy of Grey's Anatomy at some point. Got him. <laughs> <laughs> Stop memorizing where the major ones are. If it's a minor vessel, you can tend to do it. And once you pull out the branch, you'll be able to clamp them with hemostats. Oh, right. And then try and stitch the vessels back together, but that's delicate work. So honestly, if somebody ever gets impaled on a branch, let's call Dolores. Yeah, yeah, that sounds like a good plan. Yeah, I like that idea. How's Persephone acting around you now, Louise? Now you've had a bit of a ride on it. Oh, she's probably grumpy with me. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. She's still a baby. Yeah. He's a big baby. She had a good stretch, though. You know who's yeah. a big baby? You were last night when you were high as a cart. I don't remember that. I had to tuck you into bed with a blanket <laughs> and give you a glass of water, and you asked me to tell you a story, and I said no. Where's that? Where's that 10 out of 10 doctor's treatment I've heard all about? I don't have the best bedside manner. I just have the best suture. Well, I'm going to be speaking to Dolores. Bedside manner is the next training. No, I don't want to do that. Just make shit up. It'll be fine. Is that Henry up there? No, that ain't Henry. That's Henry's clone. Oh. Copycat. Wait. Let's give you a good brush. He's got a lot more white on him. Is this the governor's wagon again? Oh my goodness, the governor's here. Did they beat us here? How the- How? No, dude, you're right. You're right, dude. It's not- I- Of all the- Like, I, I will- I will never report 
or bring up someone nearly mucking up the name. Because every time people do, they like, they're like, oh, oh, shit. It's so funny. Good girl. Because George, George and Corbs is, is similar enough. So it's all good, man. It's funny. Um, Gabriel, uh, Marshall Gabriel has done it as well. So, um, he, he did that one time. So I was like, oh, no worries. Oh, well, I'm going go out. I'll hopefully find some fat loot, sir. And it's all good. It's funny. Maybe this one broke. This is their wagon, out. right? I wonder if... Because... The, did they... Is this a spare, do you think? Yeah, it may, maybe they had this one and then they called a new one. What if we take this one? What if... What if... Let me see if it's working. Yeah, jump on in. Let me sit down. It seems fine. Don't take the horse. <laughs> Don't question it. Just get in. Wait, what are you doing? Take a seat. What are you doing? We can't. Why? Oh, that's, that's the issue. Can't sit. Oh. All right, I'm sitting. Oh, this, this is just asking for trouble. Yeah. You definitely can't. <laughs> Let me try. I can get. What are you doing? I got in. First go. Ow. Ow. <laughs> See, you just sit down like this. I think this this can only have one person in it. That's their problem. All right. Oh, Jack. Let me go. Hold Sorry. on. Okay, y'all try sitting in the back now. Oh no, who is so Now I can't. I can't do it. The fuck? The horse is gone now, though. I'm so muddy. You want to ride? Should we push this wagon off a cliff? I don't. I don't think that's our problem. Louisa, you haven't shot anything with your volcanic pistol, have you? Uh, no. Follow me. Dude, I don't see a horse on it. What the? I don't see a horse. I don't know. A horse there. Dude, dude, dude. Dude. Saddle up, it's follow a, me. It's it's a cursed carriage. Oh my, oh my gosh. Well, thank you, Battle Tango. Are they coming? Oh, jeez. The uh, respond uh, to a post. Um, you post a, a letter in the, the mail. George, I don't know how to tell you this, but you took off into the sky. Oh. Like, like God himself had raptured your soul. Right, we might not worry about it then. I'll put it behind yeah. the church and we'll leave it at that. But, well, that's where it should be for an exorcism. But uh, Louisa would, uh, if we, if, oh, hi, dog. Man broke. I have to go. If we can find a, a, a quiet spot on the way to the next town, Louisa hasn't fired her volcanic pistol in anything yet. Well, that's fine. We can probably do it nearby. Are you sure you can't take a bath here, Louisa? It, it broke. I can't get in the door. All right. We can take you to a river. Yeah, I don't have to do. Oh my God, we can heal Lily from black water. Oh, sorry. <laughs> So I flew into the sky for him. Rip.
You avert your eyes, Mr. Hughes. All right. Oh, she's decided to run for the hills anyway. Jesus. Let's have a look at the the tag on Discord. Ooh, briskity goodness. Om nom nom nom. Eight hours, man. That's wild. That is wild. Um. Well, I've learned that the the doctors have a requirement. There is a call. We'll have to see if another doctor grabs it. It's by roads. Oh, uh, the doctors require like a gun and a horse to like sign up. Hey, she's not done yet. Oh. Yeah. Sorry, I'm just protecting her privacy. No, no, I, I. Understandable. Do we have to go to that report? Well, there they hasn't been a pin and nobody has uh, said responded in the carrier pigeons, so. so I might, we might have to go to that. Wait, hold on, I think I did that wrong. It is labeled horse incident by tree. It's on the way to Rhodes. Uh, south of Rhodes in Braithwaite Manor. Oh, all right. Okay. I've got the ping if you, if, if you got it. All right. I think her, I think her horse is fine. I'm not actually sure why she's not using it as much. They may be riding on the same horse just so they can talk about doctor stuff easily. You're right. It's so funny, like the the governor's always checking with Cynthia, like, you know, oh, am I am I doing enough for the Am I doing enough for the doctors? And oh you gotta make sure that George Hughes comes back to law from his break. And oh, it's so funny. It is, it is, a, a, a huge reason is literally like, um, some big things may be happening for me IRL. Like some big IRL news over the next week. And I need to be just, I need to be focusing on that and ready for it. Um, and then if, if the news, if the news is positive, uh, my schedule may radically change. So, unfortunately, while it would be a really good change in real life, um, it may result in me not being able to jump on Red Dead RP as many nights as I have been lately. I may only be able to do it once or twice a week, jump on at my usual nighttime slot. And then it may turn into I may be doing a lot uh, more um, um right, I'm here. more slots that are during the day, Australian time. So 
but I won't know until later this week. Or maybe next, like over the next seven days right, or maybe, over the next fortnight. I don't know. So, it might not happen, but, um, yeah. I just need to get that out of the way before I go back to consider going back to the law department. Because I can only handle so much at a time. Oh. I'm finding escorting the doctors as security much more relaxing. For now, anyway. Some warm water and then, uh, I mean, that's pretty much it. A lot of it, you just gotta wait. Yeah, yeah. Wait, off just pain try relief. and keep the patient, well, try and keep the patient calm and encourage, uh, I guess, when the moment comes. I don't blame yeah, not yeah. really knowing too much about that because we you know, usually face those cases. I know. We usually go to the local doctor. Um, I was trying to throw you a curveball. <laughs> that may think. Well, no, it's, what it is showing though is that you're you're looking at situations fairly analytically. You're able to, to think through it, which is the important part because you weren't that great at that on your first day, but now you're much better. Yeah, I have a, I kind of read a little bit on that in, in a book, I guess I've read a lot more for um, stuff that happens on the road, for, with, uh, let's say, with what I can carry, I guess. Uh, oh, I thought of one. All right. You are um, called to a scene because somebody has been shot, but they have taken a gunshot wound to the fingers and they are missing three fingers. Oh, what do you do? That's going to require surgery. I mean, oh. I'm not a surgeon, so I'm not going to be able to uh, stitch their fingers back. What I'm the hell happened here? Them. What's with all these bodies littering in the road? Did you see those four bodies we just passed? Yeah, I saw oh. them here earlier. They are um, um, local. They're we having issues with them from taking naps in the road. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay, so they've lost their fingers. There's no... The, the fingers are lost. Back. They're basically yeah. mashed potatoes. Okay. So, yeah. um, I guess, depending on kind of the, the wound, we look at the... Um, try, try and stitch the, the ends up, and or apply some paste, cocaine paste, stitching the, stitch the ends of them, and just bandaging them up. So really, the way I would approach that is, um... If somebody has had a, 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 okay. a spon spontaneous amputation, right? Oh, Which means okay. it wasn't done by a doctor. It's happened in an accident. They might have broken sharp bones and things like that. Oh. So what you can do is cut off more of their fingers that so it's like a straight cut. If needed. Okay. Yeah. Yep. And then you can pull the skin over and make a skin flap and sew that shut. Skin flap. Okay. Yep. That makes yep. sense. That makes so sense. You, you basically you pull the muscle tissue over the end of the bone so that it makes the bone it makes the bone not you know yeah. sharp on the end. Gives the bone some cushioning because they can't really have bone on the end. And yep. then you pull the skin over and then you stitch that. Now, I, in this case, because it's a serious wound, I would sorry, give somebody right some here. like intravenous. Sorry. Oh, sorry. That's my bad. Sorry. That's right. I, I, I should have. I didn't say it was right here. No, I, I should have been more on the left or right. My my, my apologies. What has happened to y'all? Oh. Oh my god. Oh sorry. Oh my god. Okay. What happened to you, though? Sorry, is it both of you or? Uh. He stabbed me by accident. Oh oh no. Okay. What was your name again? Just tell uh, just Dotty. Well, Dotty, of course. Okay. Uh, oh, all right, Clay, you're gonna have a big goose egg on your head. Yeah. Stabbing in the stomach there. Yes. Okay. The fact you're talking makes me happy. I'm just gonna separate you a little bit so we don't overlap voices too much. I'll, I'll put you back together, sure. No, that horse does not want to be padded.
fly. It's coming. <laughs> Play Montana. How did they both go down? <laughs> like... Yeah, definitely. Uh, now you're familiar with these more. <laughs> what, what happened? And they landed like next to each other? Like what? What the <laughs> fuck? wrapping it up now. Oh, we're down here. I was like, this is now, a really nice just, area. Can uh, you just run me through? You did suture, right? Uh, yes. So, right. uh, it was enough for um, I cleaned it, and uh, the air was clean, so I uh, began stitching, applied a gauze over it, and wrapped it in a bandage. And has she had any pain relief? Really? Yes, I gave um, cocaine paste on mm -hmm. the area. Mm -hmm. Good. Uh, bef before I stitched. All right, that's good. Now, Miss Miss Darty, I assume you're familiar with the morphine shots and how nice they feel? All right. They're fantastic. They are amazing. Now, I'm going to give that to you. And just take it easy when you get up, take it nice and slow, take a drink of water, and uh, we'll be right here for you. Wait. Oh, there you go. Much better. Oh, I might put that, yeah, good thing to put the knife away when you're dizzy. Oh, oh. thank you very much. You're welcome. Well, you're both fortunate, you're I guess, that you, you passed out next to each other. Yeah, Clay. Made, made it easier to see. Well... Yeah. About that. Aren't you lucky? <laughs> Aren't you lucky? Well, no, your, oh. your horse did this to me. Take my own horse this time. Do, do we need to separate y'all? Call the sheriff so you're right to ride together? No, we're fine. Thank you. You're fine? All right. Let us He's know. He's my you best friend. Just gotta be careful. Besties. Now, Thank you so much, you everybody. Stay safe now. All right, we gotta head into St. Danny now. Take care. Bye. Uh, George, we got Lawman. Yeah. Lawman down. In Saint Denis. Yes. Shit. Uh, the, yeah, that's what that said, right? Just said lawman in the down. bathhouse. Yeah. Where? The saloon. The saloon. Oh my god. Yes. Sorry. It better not be Jeb or Kenneth. Oh gosh. I hope not Jeb. Knowing Kenneth's track record, it's probably Kenneth. He's a magnet for bullets. When we get there, maybe hang outside for a second while I'll pop my, I'll poke my head in. Yep, no worries. I am not being reckless today, I promise. Jesus. George? I didn't see it. that. We, we got an alert that gunshots are still active in the area. Okay. Oh. Yeah, when we get close, if, if you don't mind, I'll take point. Okay. And we'll, we'll, we'll take it slow. If either of y'all need to go running off, I, you need to tell me. Yes, sir. Look at me, 
taking orders. Wow. It's for your own good, ma'am. I know you. I know you're both capable, but if, if well, anyone's getting shot out of the three of us, it should be me. Oh, I disagree with We're that. We're glad you're with us, though. We'll take the train, Bridget. Oh, not that. It's not the train bridge. The normal bridge. That's right. I got him confused. Dead horse. That does not bode well. Saloon, you say? Yes, sir. Uh, maybe Stay close to me, Louise. Maybe follow me around to the old t old side. We'll approach from there. All right. Back, 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 back to the dock. Nope. Bad, bad call for me going this way. Jesus Christ, it's right happening right fucking there. In the in the building, ladies, undercover. It is a full-on shootout, and they're all... This might be what they were warning us about yesterday happening now. They're lapping around on horses. I think that was a lawman I saw, but I can't... I didn't get a good look. Best they not fire at you thinking you're one of them or nothing. Shit, and I can hear their new fancy goddamn whistles. Shit, they might need help, like, right now. Just stay close, ladies. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, They're behind us? Who, who the fuck is that? They're just wolf. Oh. Yeah. That's not right. It's wolf. I see wolf. I think I saw Sledge's horse. Go okay, like. Let's check. What the hell's happening here? Uh, oh. It's huge. I hear we got lawmen down at the saloon. I'm trying to get the doctors there. Is, is, oh, it, shit. is it safe to approach now? Not too sure. We're not just right now. We're just yeah. coming over here to see if it's quiet. Yeah, first wave is going through now. Yeah, we rocked uh, up and there's a gunfight happening in the streets just there. All right, well, I guess we go investigate, eh? Mm -hmm. Did uh, any any clothing um, any description? Um, oh, I didn't get a good look. Just it, no, as right soon right. as I saw those shots fired off, I told the ladies, get, "Let's get back down to the dock." Yeah, yeah, absolutely. All right, um, yeah, we'll scout ahead. Just um, bring them up slowly, partner. Just do block by block. Gotcha. We'll do, sir. Oh, All right, doctors, on me. We're, fo we're following the West Sheriffs up in the ranges. Slowly. They're not even the they're not even the first wave. First wave? What do you mean? First wave of I think the first what? wave was the East Sheriffs and now the West and the Rangers are here to try and get shit together. I think it's that bad. So we're gonna get we're gonna get to that saloon safely. Follow them up. Stay with me. Check your corners. You never know what surprises there'll be. Who the fuck is that? Who the fuck is that? Is that Tessa? That Tessa? That's Tessa. Okay. Yep, there's three inside. Okay. Hello. Oh, gosh. <laughs>
All right, I've got the most serious one here. Jeb has uh, got a shoulder wound, and I'm not sure about the fourth deputy. Oh my god! There's another patient up the back as well. Oh god! Uh, Billy, Billy King. Oh my god! I got shot in the back. No, not this one. What's the, your name, partner? One of those. My name's Dick. Nice oh, to meet you, Dick. George Hughes. Hey, I feel terrible. I was with that learned the law. Tess, are you all right? Yeah, mate. Yeah. <laughs> Is your name Tessa, mate? <laughs> well, um, yeah, no, I'm fine. I, I was just trying to make sure that they didn't get any sheriff's department. Well, I just saw uh, the, the doctor's thing. I just saw the West Department and the Rangers ride by. I'm, I'm here. Mm -hmm. I'm off. I'm on a leave of absence from the department. I'm uh, escorting the doctors. So wherever you need me, just say the word. Okay. Who are you? Who, yeah, who are you at? Oh, just. Oh, yeah. Hello? Sorry, you look kind of like the chick that was shooting. Oh, sorry. That's <laughs> okay. Um, right? yeah, just stay here, just in case they're trying to come back to them, mate. Yep, I will think... do. Yeah. I'll, I'll stand here until I'm told otherwise. Okay, oh, thank wearing... you so much. Uh, grey. One mask. of them was wearing, like, gray, like, they were all wearing grey. Uh, one of them had, like, uh... Oh my god! Oh my god. god this one is missing mask. his head! Nah, one of them had a green mask in there. Um, one of them had they had weird like goggles. Yeah, careful, careful. There was a man who they took and passed this to the bank, which is why I led the sheriffs. Uh, who was wearing it like a deer head? Yeah. Oh, that uh, happened around TV, yeah. yeah, he was quite fat. Yeah, right. He's yeah. I hope I didn't put, pick myself a tiger on my back. What the fuck is going on in the map? I don't, I don't, I don't uh, know what that was, but something. Dolores. Kenneth? Uh, no, this is Cole. Oh, I'm sorry, Cole. No, that's alright. How's it going? Oh, I'm just glad I... Got a couple of doc extra doctors here safely for for y'all. It's it's not a pretty sight in there. Yeah, I, I'm so I'm so annoyed. My I was one of them with my shotgun and my head popped. What what happened? Right. I'm not sure. I just I turned up late. Um, I, I turned up late, so I just saw the other sheriffs getting shot at, and yeah, I, I, I saw one of the suspects. Of Fucking hell! Yeah. How, how many yeah. lawmen we got? Two of them, but... There's a girl with black hair and a black uh, balaclava. Um, uh, I'm not sure who the that other one was. That wasn't an actual shot, sorry. Yeah, yeah um, I think the, the lawman got two of them, but um, someone came and picked up their bodies. Is that you, Lily? It is, yeah. Is Jeb okay in there? I don't know. I got asked to leave, so I'm... Oh my god. He was, he was talking when I picked him up. Right. Oh, that's a good sign. So what's your ah! Ah! <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> well, I'm still talking. Just, and I'll try and keep talking even if you carry me in a sec. Fucking hell. Hello. Uh, oh, hello again. You alright, partner? I, oh, be, be George. Kenneth. How are you? Yeah, there's a. Uh, Kenneth, I'm all right. I'm, I'm just here. I'm helping. So I'm escorting doctors. I'm, I'm, I'm meant to be on a leave of absence, but with everything going uh -huh. on, I've become unofficial yeah. security for the doctors. Yeah, correct. So I'm. Oh, I'm going, how are you? Uh, I've been better. What's what's happened? Talk me through it. Well, we we got an alert at the bank, of course, from yeah, all in grave from unnamed me. reliable source. Okay, never yeah. mind. We're just throwing that out there. Uh, him, and uh, we rocked up to the bank, and the first guy just started shooting at us. I don't know if he said anything to you, Dick, but he didn't to us. Um, um, did they no. actually do the bank? No. no. They no. walked they, up they and took a half shot at us. Um, roads. Then oh, I, I learned the law because I thought I'd take the half I was scared, scared so I'd left my hiding in place because one of them did see me in there. Mm. And then I went out up top. I tried to get up on the balcony for a bird's eye view. And the gentleman with a yeah, right, okay. or some sort oh, oh. started following me. So I ran off. And then that's when the Lord came and they got shot. <laughs> yeah, that, that we did. Yeah, I don't know. what. A, uh, what I think this, this looks like the guys that were on the ground. So just careful. Hello. Um, hey, you. 
third, they had like uh, with the third with the other guy. What's that? I think these guys are coming back. Is that one of them? Ah, I the can't fuck? tell for sure because they had masks on, but I am. Um, the rest of their clothes look exactly the same as the guys who are on the ground. All right, I'm yeah. gonna stay in here with Mister. Oh, good. There's Hello. Jeb. Cynthia, you okay? Jeb got shot. I was. He's fine now. Though. Okay. Where, how how's it looking in there? Uh, it's hmm? still a mess. We're just onto the assailant. Howdy, sir. Howdy. This is be careful with that there landing. Oh yeah, I know. People warn me all the time. Yeah. I need to buy a new one. Yeah. You need to get um. Have you met Dick here? You need to get one of these uh, baby lanterns. Yeah, one of the little ones. I know. I think I have met you before. Yeah. Yep. Yep. We have. Yeah, in passion. Mhm. Mm yeah, he's the one that uh, alerted the sheriffs about the uh, people at the bank. In that field, trees. Shit. George. Hell, the fuck was that? So violent. <laughs> I'm going inside. Oh. <laughs> just go in the. Oh. Just go in the other room or something. I think Ding has got him. I think this guy picked the wrong time to walk down this street. Mm -hmm. Go to the church. Are you out there, mister? Yeah. Is there someone who can't look here? Yeah. Goddamn people here. Yeah. D yeah. Don't know who's to be trusted and who's not. Uh, no. They were trying to rob a bank. Okay. You alright? Yeah, that scared the devil out of me, but I'm alright. I'm glad you went back inside. Oh yeah, I'm following instructions today. <laughs> Bit like that, isn't it? No, usually I'm apparently. Let you know there so. might be another shootout soon. Here. Yeah, we got Come with me. Hips making the you, do you recall yeah. any of the guys yeah. that were Nothing there? Told. Just this one that I got. Okay, come here. Is Louis? Is Louis like, okay come, as well? Come here. I'm certain, but he's kicking up a fuss. Last time I saw her, you see uh, the one in the blatant up. same outfit as the one who blew my head off? It looks the same outfit, <laughs> okay. though. I saw the guy in that outfit land on the ground. Dang it. George! <laughs> How are you doing? Dinger. I just got shot. Shot in the side of the head, but I'm alright otherwise. Sorry to hear that, Dinger. You stay safe out there. My goodness, so many people. I was just stocking up on my morphine supply. Louise is in the pharmacy. Okay. Harkness says we may be expecting more trouble. Yep. So I heard us. I just told Dolores we'd stick up. Oh, I'm sorry. Ah, I'm, ah, sorry. Oh. I'm sorry. I got oh. nervous split. I nervous split. Oh. Oh, she, she's a bit nervous and she punched me in the face. Oh, that was an accident. Oh, yeah. A horse kicked me in the face not long ago, so it's, it's, it's adding up. <laughs> Do you need a bandit? Not yet. Let's oh, wait. I'm Let's sorry. wait till we're out of Saint Denis. Let's not waste things, bandages. 
or whatever. Uh, we, I just said to Dolores that we would stick around for a little bit since they say there might be another thing going on. She was actually in here doing paperwork when uh, it all started. Jeez. And she was the one who put out the warning that it would be hot to approach. Goodness, yeah, it certainly was. Well, you got us in here safe. Mm-hmm. Any worse time, and we would have been caught right in the middle of those horses. People riding around shooting each other. Mm, yeah. How did you go with your patient, Louisa? Uh, Any complications? Pretty, uh, no, it was pretty straightforward. Uh, gunshot at the back. Yeah, Jeb took a revolver to the back as well. Shot from the back like a coward. Yeah. So, he's going to be sore in the shoulder, but he's just mm. up and about. He did ask me not to tell Miss Lily that he got shot. Because mm. I don't think she knows he's well, on she, duty. She was right there. Oh, wait, I didn't recognize yeah, her. Yeah, she was standing out here with in. me. Oh, she then how the hell is she... How the hell am I meant to keep that a secret then? He's crazy. She seemed very calm and collected when I spoke to her. Oh, she's good. She's uh, very good at remaining calm under pressure. Like that. Hey, howdy. Howdy. Rangers. Howdy, howdy. Hi, Will. Howdy. I think, uh, yeah, they got one in custody. Oh, good. Oh, one out of how many, though? Mm -hmm. yeah. Probably just started shooting folk without saying anything. Well, we just animals. treated a bunch of wounds right to the back, so shooting people from behind like cowards. Yeah, right. Nolan right. Gray. You say Nolan Gray? Apparently it said that, sorry, they're all, all in Oh, I thought you said the name, and I was like, oh. <laughs> Nolan Gray, yeah, sorry. Interesting, right. Yeah, all, so. I was wondering if it was retaliation for what happened to Cal, because we received word yesterday they were going to be retaliating against East Law, and, uh, that didn't end up happening, but we stuck around St. Benny all yesterday, and then maybe, I was thinking maybe the move to today. Yeah, right. Hey, sorry, we gave Dinger a heads up. So I'm, I'm looking over my shoulder here. Yeah, same, Poros. Yeah, I'm not Anxious letting my guard place. down till we're out of here. Uh, no. Yeah, it didn't help that a green belt. I got fucking two of the same like weapon just in case one decides it don't want to work. That green belt, uh, I think he's gone now. Yeah, that's alright. I'm saying very, very bad stuff. Oh. Yeah, I was just hoping that he wasn't gonna. Oh, look, people are shooting their guns. I'm gonna jump in. Yeah, no, we've, we've seen a. Uh... No, he took the uh, verbal route. Yeah, yeah. I rest his soul. Oh well. Thank you. the second time that person's passed in the last five minutes. That guy was also the one in Blackwater who was uh, lurking around as well. He, funnily enough, showed up just as that guy who I said had the blue coat on and the red mask disappeared. Mm. Almost like exact timing as somebody running upstairs and taking their coat and mask off and then running downstairs would have... <laughs> oh, and I believe that's Dottie. Uh... Miss Gold, yeah, it's Miss Gold was lovely. Oh, good, Tanner. Yeah, sorry, I was just a bit angry about what happened, but I'm good. 
You right? You yeah. Need a, you need a cigarette or something? No, that guy just ran out of the doctors and just ran and called me an inappropriate name, so... Uh, oh. I took him around the corner and beat him up. Fair enough. Yep. Weird, I mean, I didn't even... I just, I was just standing across the street. Oh, the vile thing some people just come out with is... Uh, yeah. Yeah. Very weird. That's all right. How are you guys doing? Oh, we're just waiting for the... See yeah. where the action takes us. Yeah, Maybe right. I've been having some itchy suture and fingers all day, so at least I got a little bit in. You've been looking after these lovely ladies, George? You betcha. Good stuff, man. He did slowly walk us into the scene and make sure it was all coast is clear, so... He's a good man, Mr. Hughes. He sure yeah. is. You don't have to tell me. Mm -hmm. so we're still trying to figure out how we both woke up at Flatneck. Yeah, don't don't worry. Since then, Lou, I've, I'm, I'm off the drink. Like, there's just been too yeah. many times where I just... Yeah. Same here. I think we. I, I have a feeling that when we both roll, came into, came into country, may have been at a welcoming party that got a bit too crazy. I think so. With all them I green, really so. green cloth hooligans. Yep. Green <laughs> clothes. <sighs> right. No offense, Miss Wheeler. I mean, you're wearing green, but this is a different kind of green. Oh, no, I'm very well aware, and ain't nobody taking this green away from me. Yeah, if I well, take this hat off at this point, people won't recognize me since I not wearing a skirt. <laughs> so what happened here? Doctors should wear green. Apparently some shooting people in gray, shooting people. Apparently yeah, started right. with a bank, maybe? And then it went south? And then we, we rolled up into the docks because we were going to take a different route in towards the saloon, and, uh, yeah. and uh, it was hot. Be careful, they may still be around. I was talking about a man with a D hat on. I saw him come out of the uh, clothing store. Aww. So I'm sure they're still around. There were some people in the alleyways back there. Okay. Yeah, but they're, they're going out of the alleyway. Uh, we're not going to respond to a drunken mishap in Blackwater right now. Okay. Sorry, we just got word of a call, and it just says drunken mishap. And I think this mm -hmm. is more important because we were warned there'd be potentially an additional uh, gunshot yeah. fire. Yeah, look, if you need to take cover, you're more than welcome to run to the gunshot. Well, I appreciate that. We do okay. have our surgery here, but sometimes that can get a bit spicy. Yeah, well, there's a there's a wall there, just like a wooden wall. Feel free to take cover behind there if if you need to. Thank you. No problem. Well, I will leave you guys to it. You guys have yourself a great. You stay I'm safe. by the sun afternoon. Stay safe, Lou. Something like that. Take it easy. Yeah. Bye. Take care. Uh, by the way, if you see Miss Pena, please telegram me. I'm number five. I saw that she's missing. She is, and I'm very worried. Oh. Okay. And uh, that gun store is not going to run without her. Yeah, we'll keep yep. an eye out. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Wow, Georgie had to actually do some bodyguard work like that. That was hot with the with the firing going on and everything. That was what? No, I just meant like the situation <laughs> was hot. She she said it was. He said Thanks. you were hot. No, I don't be. <laughs> you said you was hot. I give up. I appreciate the compliment. <laughs> it wasn't meant to be like that. Sure, sure. <laughs> I'm just staring. <laughs> just doing my job. Yep. I just meant it was an actual live situation that we were walking into. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. <laughs> oh, who we got here? It is hot, though. The temperature, weather-wise. Yeah, cold off. It's a scorch. I've been going through my orange juices and my cowboy cocos like there's no tomorrow. Well, that's the problem. You're drinking cocoa on a hot day. That's your problem right it's there. It's so tasty, though. But it's hot on a hot day. Yeah, but... It makes you sweat. But it's cowboy cocoa. It is delicious. I do like it's, cowboy it's cocoa. It's cocoa for cowboys. I should have got more cash out. You need anything? Oh, I should. 
Mm. No, I got some orange juices. Check my food. Oh, I that got the would popcorn. Be, yeah, you can you have that. that. No, you keep it. Sure. Okay. I, you're, you're, I'm, I'm the one kind of getting paid. Less than normal, but I'm getting paid. I'll so, take the food. <laughs> so everyone's moved out from inside, right? Yeah, it's empty now. Okay. I so don't we, know if Dolores is still inside. Did you see if she was Louisa? I think so, yeah. All right. So we're just on standby, essentially. That's right. Yeah, sometimes we can be on standby for a little while. Okay. Just gonna go find a bathroom. Oh no, is that a seagull? It sounded like a seagull. You got a problem with seagull? They, they, let's just say they may have pecked me on the coconut one too many times. Oh, I like seagulls. They're fine uh, as long like as they're not pecking me. Well. Hey? I like pigeons as well. Rats of the sky? You take that back. They ain't rats of the sky. They are a noble creature that carries messages for people and then help a lot and they race and they're, they're smart and they go back home. I guess. I don't know. I wouldn't want to wouldn't want to pat one. I would pet a pigeon. Shit, there's another one. Stop trying to shoot seagulls. I think that's a pelican. Oh, my be. This pelican's just a big seagull with a big mouth. It's gonna do more than poke me on the coconut. It's gonna eat my coconut. You know that's that pelicans routinely eat smaller birds and smaller animals. Ah, oh, why? So they will actually swallow things like seagulls whole. Oh God, they are why? They're eaters because they have big mouths, and they also eat rats, and they eat lizards, and they eat pretty much anything they can fit in that that big beak of theirs. They'll they'll swallow it. What's wrong with fish every day? I don't know, mate. Do you, would you want to eat the same fish every day? Yeah, you're right. No, I wouldn't. I'm, I'd miss chicken too much. It is strange, though, that the pelican is eating a seagull. That is... Yeah, I... I related. I always thought of a pelican as, like, a big seagull. Mm-hmm. I think an albatross is more like a big seagull. They got similar shaped beaks and wings. Yeah, true. The old, old albatross. Once Louisa gets back, maybe we'll take a walk around town. Yeah, it seems seems like it's quieting down. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, frog. Seagull's gonna come. Oh, me in the coconut. What are you doing? You singing huh? a song about seagull? Mm -hmm. Oh, they sing it down on the dock. It's like a working okay. song. Oh, what's the whole song? Because Joseph usually sings for me when we work together. Oh, I, I can't remember the whole thing. It's oh. like, uh, rocking, rocking and rolling down to the beach. I'm strolling, but the seagulls poke at my head. Not fun. And I said, seagulls, hmm, stop that now. Right, that is uh, interesting. I yeah, guess. they sing it when they're like unloading ships and stuff like that. Uh huh. Do they get poked in the head by seagulls off? Sounds like it to me. Now let's take a stroll away from that, that song. What's wrong with that song? What's wrong with that song? Well, uh, it's just not my favorite. You looking down on the working class, ma'am? I, I would never. I'm sorry it's not as sophisticated as your, your high class. Name one high class musician. I would I would love to hear you try. Oh, I don't know. I'm sh I don't know. William Seliger on the piano. <laughs> well, damn it! <laughs> ah, ah, yeah. Technically, he would fit that. I'm surprised I haven't seen him today. Probably still figuring out how to play poker. I don't know if he knows how he can do that without sitting on your lap. He's probably used to people doing it for him. <laughs> what do you have against William? <laughs> what have you got against the seagull song? It's a bad song. Passes the day. Howdy. Hey, we see Marcus at all. Uh, they got off. They, all the rangers got on horses before and rode off. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. All good. Jeez. That might okay. have been five, ten minutes ago. Oh, well, 
that's not a good thing. She doesn't like the seagull song. Said to him, show Everyone? Me the he Sacrilege. Uh -huh. Actual George, sac- why can't you have a song about pigeon? It's- I didn't make up- I didn't make the song. This is what the, they sing it out at the dark. You should make a song about pigeons. If that song gets them through the work day, who are you to judge then? I ain't judging. I can just say that I don't like a song. I don't have to like well, every song I hear. Well, you don't have to go hauling crates down the dock, so don't you worry about it. I would never. I'd probably, I don't know, break a fingernail or something. Oh, go go get your hair brushed. <laughs> Excuse me, Elisa. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> what? You, you forget what haircut you had yesterday. Hey, hmm, what? Uh, we've lost Louisa. She will be fine. She'll find. Okay, just doing my job. <laughs> Talking about brushing my hair when you had hair like that yesterday. Hey, you're, you, you're, you're throwing some low blows at the, at the working at class. The seagulls? No, at the working class. I ain't throwing. No, I am working class now. I have you know. Everyone on the dock loves that song. Maybe I need to make a song about stitching people up. Yeah, right. What? How's it gonna go? I don't know. I'm not a songwriter. I ain't a creative person. Why they got a skull on the desk? Ain't that a little off brand? It's a, probably a sugar skull. Fuck's a sugar skull. It's a skull made out of sugar. That seems excessive. A little, it bit, is. little bit grim for my taste. A lot of things are grim for your taste. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, no, I'm sorry. I'd, see, I told you she'd find us. She smells us and comes around and. Oh, I was just coming for. Uh... Louisa, do you like the seagull song? I, I haven't heard it. What is the seagull They sing it down song? on the dock all the time, but Miss Cynthia thinks it's silly. Oh. You gonna uh, sing it for a minute? I, I haven't spent my time down there. I can't the remember the whole thing, but the start of it goes a little something like this. <clears throat> rocking, rocking and rolling. Down to the beach I'm strolling. But the seagulls... Poke at my head, not fun. And I said, Seagulls, hmm, stop that now. Hmm. Um, we have a case to get to in Blackwater. Oh, okay. Right. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> ah! No, I got no money. It's not in mind. Tough crowd. <laughs> but the seagulls poking my head not fun. And I said, Seagulls, stop that now. Right? Uncultured. Uncultured. It's the only explanation, Rando. They didn't even... Well, maybe it's because they didn't hear the, um, hoo, ha, hoo, 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 ha, part. Maybe, maybe that's what really just gets people across the line and enjoying the song. The rest is just filler. Well, if I get another chance, I'll make sure I include the ooh, ah, ooh, 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 ah. And then I think we'll have a couple of Seagull fans joining the ranks ooh, ah, ooh, 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 ah. Everyone told me not to walk on that beach. Said seagull's gonna come. Poke me in the coconut. 
And they did. Run, 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 jump. I can be a backpack while we run. <laughs> Swing from a hairy vine. Hopefully they, they be patient if they read the notes. That is pinkish in color coming out of his ears. What do you do? Right. Patient unresponsive in this case. No visible head wound or bruising though. And some swelling. Let's say you can't necessarily feel a skull fracture unless it's a really bad skull fracture. If it's a bad enough skull fracture that you can feel it easily, then that person is dead. So if somebody has a pinkish sort of fluid coming out of their ears after a head injury and they're unresponsive uh, they have had a very bad head injury and they have that that fluid that's coming out is the fluid that the brain floats in in the skull and it comes out the ears here not necessarily sometimes they can recover um, but they will not be the same as they ever were before. Uh, okay then. Um. Alright, I got a question. You come upon a scene and it is a long man wearing an orange vest and he's on the ground. He's surrounded by seagulls who are poking at his head. Yeah. What do you do? Shoot the seagulls. Thank you. In the tent. <laughs> And attend to the law man on the ground. And then you tell him that he didn't tell them enough to stop it now. You should have thrown some biscuits or something, crumbs, <laughs> away. And then ran for cover. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's get him out of here. Distract the seagulls. And then tend to... Alright, let's see. Uh, you attend the case at a ranch, a cattle ranch. And somebody on the ranch has been gored by a bull. Oh. You know what gored means, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Alright, so how do you, uh, and the, they're still in the field with the angry bull. How do you approach the scene? Oh, alright. Um, I think make sure that I'm not wearing anything red. Because I think bulls like the color red. Oh, well, it's too late for that. The patient is covered in red. Yeah, oh, oh, okay, okay. Um. Oh, I don't want to shoot the bull. Don't make me shoot the bull. Uh, I would try and... Wait, is there it? Yeah. Oh. Do I have to shoot the bull? It's a hard one. In some cases, you yeah. will have to shoot any vicious animal, even if it's domesticated. Oh, okay. Um, if it's, it's, it's going to attack if me, if there's and other I gotta people get who are around, maybe who work on the ranch, who might be able to assist you in getting that whole last oh. out of there. Um, sometimes they might be your patient might be close enough to the fence that you could duck in, grab them, and pull them out. Oh, yeah, that would that would be. The while option. somebody else distracts them. Um, mm -hmm. How would you then treat a bull goring? Because you know, uh, when, when a bull gets their horns in you, they can 
stab you and then pull, so they're pulling apart yeah. the tissue. Okay. Uh, I guess it would be kind of like the same as a bear, you know, with its claws. It'd be you know, very nasty gash. Um, so I might have to... So a boring, I would say, is actually more closely a impaling. Impaling. Than, like than the tree. Right, more like the tree than a okay, stabbing yep. or a bare laceration because it is a larger object. The bull's horn goes in there, mm -hmm. the, you know, pushes through, and then uh, <laughs> Red, is I out. stop them so you don't get the option of picking whether you're taking it out. It's already out. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, not hesitation. Really, a lot of the times when it comes to bull gorings, light uh, that the shit up. Horns are long enough <laughs> that they can impact the organs. If oh. if, if his liver or so his stomach or something that. has been hurt. He's not long for this world. Probably two, three days now. Ooh, okay. Just making them comfortable, I guess. Yeah. Internal organ damage is not something we've, you know, we have a lot of resources yet in the world. We're hoping for more scientific discoveries on that in the future. Mm -hmm. you know, there, there's definitely some techniques out there, but uh, in cases like that, it you know, would be very bad. Okay. So, let's say, all right, you have a patient who uh, you know is going to die. How do you make them comfortable? Well, neither the the cocaine paste or the morphine, I guess. Oh, I don't want to. Would that be wasting the morphine? I no, yes. not at all. Morphine, okay. definitely. Just to make them, just to make them comfortable yep. and laudanum, so the, the the liquid laudanum. opium. Yep. Uh, and to keep them sedated, even if they, because you know, they're not going to survive anyway. Uh, mm -hmm. For their comfort, chloroform. Chloroform. Oh yeah. Yep. Oh yeah. You were mentioning this earlier. If they are lucid at all, you could call in a priest to perform the last rites. And that's important, yeah. Yep. Contact any family members that you know of. Mm -hmm. oh, sorry, go to, sorry. I want to go to the train track. The, so the I'm train, daydreaming. Uh, you want to go to the train is? track? No, yeah, we can't yeah. go to the train tracks because you'll fall off. We've got two people on a horse. No, no, you got, there's a path underneath it. What do you mean? Uh, yeah, I've seen it. Shortcut. Yeah, yeah. It's the shortcut. Is that what you're going for, George? No, I was, I was, I was actually daydreaming. Sorry. Sorry, you're daydreaming to me talking you're about down the Go down there. Hey, the what? Don't right. worry. There you go. Shit. This is not good. We just got a call for lawmen down in Valentine as well. We have to treat this oh. first. Oh fuck. Do... Wait, this was just a. Do you want me to? No. You still need to be there. They know we'll be coming. Go right? Nope. We're going right now. We'll have to show her, Louisa. Yeah, uh, we can yeah. do it next time. When there's less urgency. Yeah. Um, yeah, you would you would also go find all the family members and friends that you know and bring them in. Mm -hmm. And let them say goodbye. No matter what, they're usually gone within three days. Yeah. Yeah. Go to the doctor's office. And the horse is angry. All I have to do is switch out to Lapis. Apparently they were right here, and they are no longer. Jeff? Lapis. Howdy. You stuck. We uh, thought we would uh, try and make it here first, just to try and make sure everything's uh, going to be all good. Uh, but... there's, gun there's lawmen down in Valentine. We're about to head there.
Hey, I can hear Wait, you I heard a voice. Oh, yeah, Where yeah, are you? Yeah, yeah. Hello? Keep talking. I'm hearing help. Rooftop. Surely not on the damn roof. We're going up to the roof. Uh, no one's up here. Oh, dang it. I can hear someone, Louisa, but I can't see you. God damn it. Sorry, I just landed on that horse. Your son. Sir, where are you? In the doctor's office. Oh, you are in the office. Oh, you roped over me. Ah. Huh? We can't we see can't you. See you. Wait, hang on, I, hang on, I think I got him. Here we go. You got oh! Him. All right, let's put him on the pavement outside. Were you the drunken mishap, sir? I fell off the roof. Oh, okay. I'm gonna quickly evaluate you. You guys get the horses ready to get to Valentine. Um, they said that uh, there's some llama there at Valentine. What's up? Uh, you got some pain in your you leg, know what happened? Sir? I broke my arm. Not yet. I can feel it's bending oh, the wrong way. Oh, I don't. Tano, are you? Uh, what's the. Uh... Yeah, fuck it. Let's go for a quick lick on Valentine. Do you want to ride Sorry ahead, there, sir? Partner. I had no idea. Jumping on horses now. Oh, just, just willy nilly jumping up on folk. God damn. We're breaking through the right. Look. You know. We'll see y'all there. Okay, sir. I'm gonna be straightening your bones right now. Louisa, can you uh give him a shot of laudanum? Not sure. Alright, so we're gonna give you the shot of the good stuff, and then I'm gonna be uh setting your bones to be straight. You got did it, tequila. Uh, yeah, I do. Solid. Right. And what's your name? I have noticed balls. Can you say that a little bit louder for me? Balls. Your name is Balls. People call me Balls. What is your legal name for my legal report on you? Cojones Gonzalez. Alright, we ready, Louisa? Yep. Alright, this is gonna hurt like hell. And, uh, you're probably gonna. Uh. Ah! Alright, now your bones are straight, as they should be, as God intended. He passed out even with all the tequila. Oh, I put him in a sling. He's gonna have to stay like that for a while. Okay. Ain't much we can do otherwise. Um, we can we can apply a splint, but in more cases with the arms, it's not great. Better off with the leg. We don't have anything we, else we can keep uh, keep it straight. So, sir, sir, are you with me? I'm slapping your cheek. Right, I'm gonna give you a shot of the good stuff, the morphine. It's gonna get you on your feet, but you're gonna have to stay in this sling for like a week. Okay. Alright, take it easy. Nope. Alright, maybe not on the ground. Come on, sir. Mm -hmm. Up you get. We do have a very serious case to get to, so I would rather get you on your feet. Sit down somewhere, have a bottle of tequila, and uh, try not to get your troubles. Uh -huh. And stay off that arm. 
Okay. All right. You now you come see us if you need anything else, okay? Thank you, Senorita. Do not use that arm. All right, Valentine. All right, let's go. We need a speed lapis. Come on. I haven't heard from him in a minute. I was gonna say, when we get there, do you want to take point and walk us in? Okay. Uh, George is struggling a bit. I need to get her some apples. I think so. <laughs> Would you do they happen to say whereabouts in Valentine? I'll double check. Outside of the saloon, but if it's law, they've probably gone a few doors down to the doctor's office all this year. Yeah, no doubt.
Everything okay? Yeah, it's all good. It's just sledge versus roof. Oh. Oh. Uh, why did we get a but thing saying gunshot there? He's strong. He's got big lungs. He's got well, big, I don't know big everything, if you know what I mean. But, uh, <clears throat> and then, and then, no, and then no, finally, a bat nice. flew down, he smacked got him shot. on the head, knocked him out, and he fell to his death and, and okay, almost died. I'll move out. Thank you. All right, what happened here? Give me that. Uh, he fell secure. off the roof. <laughs> well, we got a thing that said gunshot. We... Who the fuck said JSW? <laughs> I could fix it. I could I could fix it. <laughs> Right. Let's examine it. I think he's gonna oh, have a mighty big goose egg. No, right. I should so, say my uh, leg is in different oh, places. Uh, you can join oh, the goose egg club. I had a look at him. He, he's, he's left knee there. He got a kneecap on the backwards. You gotta think about boots real quick. Oh, uh, <clears throat> you know that means we have to take you into the surgery room, right? And actually put you under with chloroform? This, you see his knee, his knee's a bit twisted around the back. The, I need to... knee, knee putting on backwards is the sort of injury that'll put you out of work for two weeks. He fine though. He fine. He, he's a strong man. A he's a strong man. He saved. He saved at least eleven orphanages on the way down, and fought a bear. All right. What I'm seeing here is the a... puppies. Oh, the puppies. There's lots of puppies. Like at least a thousand of the puppies. What I'm seeing here oh, that you might be puppies. thinking is his knee on backwards. Is uh, is he's actually dislocated his hip slightly. Not too bad. I'm gonna pop it back into place. How's this? Okay. Right. Well, I, g do. I give him some whiskey. I listen to his lungs. Listen, you see all these bruises on his chest? That's nothing. Uh -huh. He fought off a bear. He fought off a bear too. So this is right. nothing. Can I, uh, Louise? Just like we did before, can you please get him a shot of laudanum? Okay. Ooh, what's this laudanum you speak of? It's liquid opium. Oh, well, yes. shit. <laughs> well, the good stuff. I seem to have fallen, fought off a bear, and say some orphanages. <laughs> I'm in pain. Get up, you know, dog. You know what? The stuff it'll make you throw up. Oh. Don't right. choke on your just vomit. Ready to in Go for it. I'm just gonna eat some food while I watch this. Give me a countdown, please. I don't believe in giving them countdowns. I believe in stabbing them when they least expect. Go. Okay. Mm, mm, mm. All right. When she does that, okay. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna snap it back in place. Three. All right. Look at the beautiful two. ladies over there, Jean. Oh, I forgot to take one. Okay. Oh, this all is right, lovely. There you go. I'm all out of love. <laughs> you need your legs back in place. Uh, yeah, the laudanum makes it a lot easier. Gene is so lost with that. Now, you. you might find you'll walk funny for a day or so, but you'll be fine. And oh, uh, You know, he always has to walk funny on account of his... Uh, you have to be so <laughs> rude in front of the women. All right, we're just going to clean you up a little bit uh, and check on, your head man. for any other... Walter, Walter, Walter. Head... Even his pants are off. Sheesh. Oh, they got to get everything and can off. You tell sure me your uh, full name were... and the and the year. You know. Gene Sledge. No. And what's yeah, the year? Yeah, it's two seasons. Yeah. It's yeah. 1890. No, it's 1900. It's 1900. You're right. There you go. Uh, see what a guess. Uh, you don't, you far, don't seem concussed, so I'm going to yeah. give you back your shot. Of course. Of course. You understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We get it. We get it. We get it. We like to be thorough. Check us out. sure. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But uh, there were three individuals in here. What's the score? Out of ten. Um, one woman, well, we, two we've men. Just fixed him, so one well dressed. He's going to make a full recovery. Uh, <laughs> the other one in black. You're welcome. But it now, seems yeah, to I'm glad your knee isn't on backwards because that would take you a while to recover from. Mm. A bit from sore, experience. but I should be right. <laughs> hey, Agnes uh, looks like I can't ride my horse today. Oh, you're going to have to be what they call a passenger princess, I guess. I'm pretty sure it wasn't. Yeah, it's your turn now. Yeah, it's about time. About then, fucking yeah. time. <laughs> oh, he, oh. Give him a doctor's no. certificate. Oh, yeah, I definitely need one. He's working them guns. Uh, didn't happen, did he? And then all of a sudden, <laughs> they started Get back shooting. to work. They're not strong. Yeah, there's a lot to do. Oh, I, I just know how much. It's a pretty good thing. Uh, but Thank you for the help. Yeah. I am looking You're for... Welcome. I know Miss Firefly does... So it wasn't gunshots. ...deliveries down to Armadillo. And, There's a lot of people uh, in Valentine right say, now, too. We haven't Sorry. seen Miss Rose. We haven't seen her for four days. We haven't seen her for four days. Three, four, that sounds like an six, issue, seven, not an issue me. Uh, that sounds come like it's in your thing. I thought I'd better come in. I was just about to head down to Almadillo <laughs> and see if we could find, have a look at something. Nice. Uh, just going to observe those hips and make sure that they're... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah, Let's just yeah. do... <laughs> oh, wait, wait, don't, wait until you don't see gold guns no more. Yeah, it'll open up two we're things. We're just uh, we're just checking your hip score there, Jean. 
good. We're, yeah, we're just observing. Yeah, we're just checking. Well, well I'm glad it wasn't gunshot. We yeah, I was expecting a whole lot more I like madness than that. <laughs> I like that he hasn't noticed us. Oh, hello. <laughs> Yeah, we just want to see Jane walk a bit. Oh well, thank you. We're just we're just watching uh, Jane at the moment. Well, oh dear. Is what is Walt? Walt? Not a show for them. Oh, look at him live. I didn't realize he was such a ladies' man. He just he'll can't, catch up. He just can't just do his job, can he? No, God no. I think I don't think I've seen Walt ever just do his job. I need a cigarette if I'm going to be looking at this. Do you need help, Jane? Jesus <laughs> Christ. Alright, well, good luck. I think he's stable. <laughs> She's just observing you, Jane. Keep going. Keep walking, Jane. Uh, yeah, just making sure you're. You can do uh, it. You know, moving the right way. Proud mm -hmm. of you. That's. <laughs> Is that your horse, <laughs> Sally? Why is your shirt not back on? She raises a good point. She does raise a great point. It's a bit cold. Man, Walt's gone crazy today. I think he's lost. Walt is putting on a show for a bunch of ladies right now. It's, it's concerning. And no, he, he, he to was see you full in the mud. Shot by locals not a half hour ago. I think he's he's going through some things. No, that's that's normal. This is how he always is. Oh, I did not. I, I gave him an air kiss. An air kiss. I did not touch about? his cheeks, although Dull, I did touch the other cheeks. put some clothes on before you get swine flu. Stop showing up oh, for the lady. It's dirt. Dirt's back. Three hundred dollar fine. Hey, ladies, you want to see a gun show? It's only three hundred dollars. Yep. Where's your horse here? All right, I'm gonna go inside my domicile now. It's what? Why do you want to see Khaleesi? Fuck! Lord. I just, I like looking at her. Is there a problem? Are you looking at it? I want to look at his... <laughs> oh, <hey. laughs> she wants me to show her my thing, and I'm, I don't know if I, I want to look at it. What? The horse? Is what that what the fuck did we come back to? <laughs> I gotta jump through mm -hmm. this window. Oh, um, yeah, you can't. You gotta jump through the inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. inside, I inside. Money for you can do it, I believe <laughs> you. That's what I did in the black water again. I would just want to go back. Why is your window Duh. broken? What about this window? Uh, finally getting paid. Take things too. Gotta wait for the marshal. Not marshal. Oh, damn it. Right, Seems to be working for me. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Khaleesi. Dirt. Khaleesi? Yeah, who has Khaleesi? Who the shop break at your window? It's Khaleesi. <laughs> Khaleesi. Is that a horse? That is a horse. It sounds that like is a horse, that horse. This is my horse. My horse is amazing. It just disappeared. I oh, know. Let's, uh, let's just go down. Let me ride! <laughs> what was that, Cynthia? That was some Lally Cola. Co just Cola? Oh, yeah, it was just Cola. I'm not drinking on the job today. <laughs> Alright. Just check it. Looked like an awfully fancy bottle. This ain't. Have a good night, everyone. Thank you very much. Bye. 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 Who's gonna buy me a drink? Stay safe. Oh, Walter, I have a drink if you want a drink. What's your. Oh, a... ah. oh. Wow. <laughs> Please what don't spill know? my cowboy cocoa. Oh, yeah, sheesh. Oh, I got a cowboy cocoa. Why was my bodyguard not bodyguard? Oh, you're okay. Cowboy cocoa calls, ma'am. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Alright, sorry. It's startled me though. I'm talking no more. Alright, who wants to let me do bad choices and, and good things? I mean, no mud. good We're things good. and bad choices or uh, whatever it is. Do you want to do my gun up? Uh, 
you got cash? Yeah. You got cash? Well, what? shit, you know, the way to my fucking well, thank heart. thank you kindly. <laughs> do you know about how Jeff got his Uh, I do. Hey, hey, let's put on a gun show. An actual gun show for once. I would take, I promise. Yeah, the people. Oh, God. I'm trying to steal this horse. No. She's Maybe. wanting her own horse at the moment. No, you can, you can, you can, you can buy one Just down like at Sweetheart Stable. It's, it's super cheap. Wait, who what doesn't have a horse? Cheap? Horses. You don't I have don't... a horse? No, no, I have a horse. Oh. I want an Arabian. Oh, never mind. I was gonna. All right, I need to find 1940. Home for him. How much? Sorry. 1940. That's how much we charge. 1940. Damn, you were quick with that price. <laughs> <laughs> She's ready. Look, it's the same price as a Missouri Fox Trotter, and so... Do you know how many of Missouri Fox Trotters I've sold? Too many. Do you know how many of them are black? Too many. All of them. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta start upcharging black horses. I do like the Roadster, but the Roadster's just too big, I think. If you think that's too big, You should big, probably buy some shy. hay for the horses. <laughs> I have. <laughs> That's a big horse. The Shire next Isn't that the Shire? No, this is Ardennes. Ardennes. Ardennes is the second tallest. He's chunky. Her name is Persephone. I got her yesterday. So am I in the right places? Oh, lordy. And yours? Ardennes is a is a French war horse. He's oh, oh my yeah, she's very chunky. Right. Oh, sorry, she keep going. Oh, it just reminds me of a past rain. horse. Over. Percy. With the pistol so big and it's his sitting in hey. his hand. He's gonna land you, his good old man. Oh. <laughs> Where are we headed now? Oh no, not the fire. We're just getting some hay. Is, uh, Persephone's a hungry girl. I bet. Look at the size of her. She eats a lot. Yeah. All that, all that muscle. I gotta get some pies for me. Oh, all right. <laughs> Wait, are you wearing my fucking hat? What? I had to bring out my backup hat. What are you talking about? Right, yeah, clever. Oh, yeah, that's right. Are you uh, enjoying your day? Yeah. No, it's been actually quite relaxing, in a way. Really? Yeah. We're not being too boring for you? No, not at all. All right, let's. Uh, we could make our way across the roads, maybe. Mm-hmm. See, sometimes it's good just being in county when it's, uh, what, and having a quiet time. I wouldn't say it's oh, quiet. Do you remember that mass casualty incident we just attended to? Oh, yeah. No, that, I meant, That was what? like less than an hour ago. Ah. I mean, earlier. Er There's nothing. It was quieter. Um, it is good sometimes to be able to collect the paycheck and uh, then be able to afford to eat, mm -hmm. you know, without too much fuss. Well, I can get pies again now. I'm happy. I finally have. Well, I'm so I'll get enough money and then I can pay back dirt because he gave me that money for the horse. Although he, I don't think he wants me to pay him back. George. Yep. 
What is the like number one rule of being a bodyguard? Number one like thing you gotta be aware. The uh, the person you guard. No, you always gotta be uh, prepared for anything. Oh yeah. All right. Why? What happened? Nothing. Nothing. I'm just saying. No, I've, I've been I've been keeping an eye on all over the place all night. You said we were going to roads? Yep, I'm going the wrong way. I was doing I was aggressively petting my horse there for a minute. I was trying to figure out why. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, she just looks so pettable. Maybe she'll stop kicking us. No, she, if she's learned anything from Henry from being in the stable with him, she won't. He's a bad influence. God damn it, Henry. Why the hell did she jump? Persephone, you're hot? I wonder if we'll see Shuba soon so I can give you your assessment. Oh my, yeah. Oh, I forgot the time. When is the time? It is around the right time. I think my horse has like a lung problem, like asthma or something. Oh. She, she sounds oh. like a pig. She's snorting. Yeah, they get that way. Yeah. Oh, look, the boss in here. I didn't know that. That's probably the first time Sometimes I've Sometimes they drift down this far, but that one's by himself. Oh. Lone bison. You checked on your bison in the plains lately, George? No, I've been. I've been forgetting to. It's alright. I'll check on them. Appreciate that. Checked on them every day while you weren't here in Boston. Really? I did? Yeah, I made a point of it every morning. Aw, oh, thank you. This is one of the better views in the county, I think. You can see the whole bay. Wow, oh, yeah. 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 Wow. I need to get a boat. You really want a boat? Yeah, I want a boat. Maybe a, a second. Boat or a tuna? Yeah, like a dinghy? I don't know. Just a boat. I don't know which one yet. Maybe uh, being a ship captain is in your future. 
Oh, I don't know if I'd go that far. Going out on the water every now and again would be nice, Whoop. but every day. Ugh. You get seasick? Nah. I'm just bored. Bird. Oh. Ha Boy, it sure is quiet. Hey? <laughs> What do you mean? Oh no, you set the car Oh no, short. it's quiet. I sure hope nothing disrupts this quiet ride we're having. Hey! It's quiet, George. And that's bad? No, we're not allowed to say the word quiet. It makes why why are you happen. saying it then? Because <laughs> I'm stirring the pot. Oh god. <laughs> oh no, what have you done? This is a nice spot to ride through. Yeah, it's a nice quiet spot to ride through. Oh. It's a, it's a, a rule that we have in the, in the doctors. You don't say the Q word. Sometimes you don't even say the R word. I'll like, say relaxing. It's, it's not busy. <laughs> I mean, even then, not. we're not supposed to acknowledge when it's quiet. It's a, opens yourself up to chaos. So I did say I was going to behave today. Yes, you did. I think I've done pretty well so far. I've been listening. Uh-huh. I haven't been mauled by a bear. Yeah, that's already better than yesterday. But to be fair, last, uh, last night you got mauled by a bear really late. So there's still time. Shit. having some issues. I'll send her to the stable for a minute. See, she's like dance. So one of us was getting kicked. Mm -hmm. Started wearing an extra hat and the hat on. And the coat. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, George, I should give you a hmm? a payment a payment for your work today. Hmm? Yep. I think I gave it to the right person.
No, you didn't. <laughs> Can you please hand that on him? Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Might kind of use. No, thank you for looking out for us. Oh, anytime. Where's she gone? What's upstairs? The bathtub. An upstairs bathtub. Fancy. Just think it'd be easier if it was on the ground floor. It's a lot of extra effort. Oh, you know what's nice? You got the front, the front uh, balcony. But have you seen the back one? Indian reservation? Yeah, have you seen mm -hmm. it at the back? Sorry, we got a call. We're just looking at the details of the oh. Wapiti. Oh. Just as I was oh. thinking of going off duty. Yeah, how nice is this? Oh, this is nice. Oh, they got stairs. It's a good mm. thing we can get to our horses now. Should we go on Lapis? Come on, Lapis. Wait. Oh. Um, I'm actually gonna take the opportunity then to clock off duty if somebody if another doctor okay. already has that. So I might head to the doctor's office here for the night. Alright. Thank you very much. I'll um I'll um. go try and meet that one up north then. Alright, yeah, that might be a good idea. Hey, George, do you mind taking Miss Louisa, if you're still going to be around, to the Wapiti Indian Reservation so she can meet up with the next doctor? You bet. All right. Well, thank you for taking care of us today. I'm going to head out. Not a problem. You have a good sleep, Cynthia. No worries. You stay safe, Louisa. Will do. You take care, too. All right, Louisa. I'll get you there nice and safe. Yo! Zombies. It's a bit of a... Zombies love bacon. Coming in with the raid. Howdy, partner. Howdy, howdy, Mr. Bacon. How are we doing this evening? Is there, has everybody been having a, a wonderful evening? What were you playing? We've just been, um... We've been, uh, doing some more... Uh, body... Uh, what? They call it being a bodyguard, but I'm like, nah, it's... Security, security for the doctors. Just been escorting them around, keeping them safe. No, there's been no funny business. There was a shootout in Saint Denis, but um, we um. I ain't a bodyguard. I remember what uh, what happened up there though. Yeah, I didn't catch that. And oh, what's going? I've been up there once, probably once, but uh, I don't remember what happened up there. So, I uh, don't think it was good. There was one time I went up with Woodman and Sledge and Harkness about a, there was a drug deal, and literally the whole place was deserted. Oh. Yeah, not even anyone stumbling around, you know, post-opium. There's just nobody. Oh. So strange. Playing seven days tonight. I tried. I really gotta give seven days to die another go. I tried it once. Uh God, when did I try it? Maybe during COVID? Maybe before COVID? I tried it, but I think my friends that I was playing with, they weren't really slow and patient to like teach me the ropes. Like they were a bit like just jumping into it. I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing. Do I die now or on the seventh day? <laughs> I don't know. That's good to hear. But thank you again. Thanks for coming over with the raid. Um, I, I think I will... I've been yawning for a bit. I think I will escort Louisa here to... 
this Wapka Wapiti to link up with the other Doctor, and then I might see them to where they're going to next, and then I think I will um, sign off for the night as well. Because my God, the yawns, the yawns are the yawns are real right now. My God. Let me uh, know if I get too fast or too far ahead. Ah, you're right, Louise. I'm just in my head a little bit. Okay. But I promise I'm not daydreaming. Oh, look at that view from this angle with the with the mist over there. Look at that. Look at that. It's about to drop its 1.0 finally. It's a small smooth twist. Yeah, I felt when I tried it, I was like, I could see what they were doing, going for, but it just, the, yeah, I guess the, the, the years ago scuffedness and I think that my friends that I was playing with, um, <laughs> They just weren't really patient with teaching me. I was like, ah. I am very spoiled by now with, um, with smooth gaming experiences. I can be very, <laughs> I can be very picky. I'm like, getting old, damn it. This is too confusing. I, I don't know what I'm doing. This ain't, this ain't user friendly and I'm an idiot. <laughs> So hello, Dame. Also, hello, Mcdura. And yeah, sorry, every, everyone that came over with zombies. Hello, hello, hello. Sorry, I'm um. It's hard to, cause the focus with these streams is on the, is on the RP. Like trying not to ignore anyone in character. Um. So I do apologise for the lack of um, bells and whistles. Sorry, Louisa, but Georgie's getting tired. She's gone to the fog. Louise, I'm sorry, I've fallen my hand! <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh no! Louise, I'm sorry, my hole's getting tired! Oh, look at her putting the light on. Oh, zombies, um, zombies raided over just, just now, Dame. Which was, which was, which was very nice. While I, I'll be on this just for a bit longer. This Gilton the Doctors. Oh damn! It's like playing this has been good, but I've just had a bunch of IRL stuff going on. So, um, hopefully, I'll have a better idea of how things are looking over the next couple of days or over the next week, and then I should be able to get. I should have a a, a better grasp of things. No, absolutely. Escorting the doctors has been a much more chill experience. And it's nice to be able to, like, actually, like, spend more time with a bunch of the doctors and see how they work. And then, and then talking to other people through them that I usually would never talk to in places in the, in the game where being in the West Law jurisdiction, rarely get to go to. So it's been a really nice change of pace. It's been really good. It can be tough, Dane. It can be tough and just... It's just some of the stuff I'm going through at the moment. It's a lot all at once. And it's just hard. Like, I need... You have some hay to feed your horse? I forgot to get some. I'm sorry. Oh, here. I've got some for you. You sure? Yeah. I was meant to get some apples, but I don't know what the hell I was thinking about. Oh, thank you. I just... Yeah, the less... Oh, the less distractions, the better. Um... Because, yeah, I've... I just... I just struggle with... your horse. Thank you so much, Louisa. That's... That's... You're Georgie's welcome. feeling better already. Yeah. I just... I get... I good stuff that hay? Like, in certain circumstances and job scenarios, like, I can handle a whole bunch of stuff at once. Um, but in other situations, like, other scenarios, I just, I get very overwhelmed. And I just, I've never been, I've never been able to effectively deal with it. So I just, I'm very, I'm very notorious for going quiet, shutting people out, um... 
alienating myself, you know, just... And just... And then just reducing all the things I'm doing. So I just... I don't know how else to deal with it. I just... Oops, oops. Sorry. And it's usually when it has oh, to deal Raven. with... Oh, Oh. Did you, uh, treat someone up here? I did. He, uh, he starved. Oh, oh, no. oh gosh. Yeah, gotta try real hard to do that, but... I, I um... Got, gave oh, him something to get his blood sugar up and gave him one of my fish burgers. So, oh, uh, good. Okay. He owes me four bucks, but uh, I'll let it go for now. Oh, sure. Well, um, yeah, I was riding along with Cynthia, but she's uh, clocked off for tonight. So oh, I'm sorry. Mind if I, I tag along? Or... Yeah, absolutely. I, I, I knew like this wasn't my jurisdiction tonight, but I was like hunting in the Heartlands and no one was responding to it, so I kind of thought that I was gonna. Yeah, um. Uh... I think we were just like looking at where it was, but yeah. All right, yeah. I was gonna I was gonna ride back somewhere. Where there's not wolves and do paperwork. Yeah, no, that's that's a good idea. All right. We got Mr. Hughes here. Hello, Mr. Hughes. Extra extra security. You need it. I get kind of nervous riding by myself in the woods at night, but what do you do? Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm happy to escort y'all to where you're going next before I head back to Blackwater. Yeah. Anywhere in particular you were heading? Oh, uh, no, I was gonna go to like the nearest. No, let's get out of the woods. But I can go back to Blackwater. Oh yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right. Yep. We'll we'll escort you uh, back to Blackwater, Mister uh, Mister Hughes. Oh, you're too kind. <laughs> <laughs> now it's a shame Woodman wasn't around because uh, he was up for doing a bit of security recently. Oh yeah. And we were, uh, you know, the other night we were looking, you know, able to split up the group. You know, make sure two groups of doctors had, you know, an extra bit of, extra pair of hands just watching their back. It's a shame. I don't know where yeah, he's been would, tonight. That would be, uh, extra, uh, appreciative. Um, I'm so supposed to meet up, uh, and try and get an assessment done tonight. So. Yeah. So, um, not sure exactly when. God, the, the urge to always just go and jump off that bridge. Every time I look at him, I'm like, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't you do it. And I'm like, I wanna. I wanna. Let me. Just the once. Just uh, let me do it. Me, I met a couple, and one of them, her name was Stormy. She's like, new, new. To, uh, oh, yeah. To like Oh, good. Yeah. Well, I know there's Eric. Oh, yeah. on the range. Oh, hang on. You know what? I'm going to check my map. I said seagulls, stop that now. <laughs> seagulls Just make sure gonna go. getting out of these woods safely. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, in the coconut, um, but yeah, I say so, he goes. No, there's a, a couple of people that's so it'd be really good to see them uh, run around with others next. Yeah, I told her that we always use more doctors, and I told her, um, her man that, uh, he should be a sheriff, because then they also need more sheriffs. Oh, yeah, that too. So if he's interested, really, uh, looking for that. I like the way they got, they, I think they've both got lanterns on. So it's almost like... With their movement, like the the flashing on and off of the the lantern on the ground, it's like whoop whoop. So what have you been doing on your like downtime? It's not a lot of call-outs. Um, actually just spending time with some friends. Uh, I helped them pick some oranges earlier. And, um, it's been good. Catching up with them, just, just riding around. Rocking. Rocking and rolling. Down to the beach, I'm strolling. Put the seagulls poking yeah, my head. Not fun. And I'll say a seagulls. I'll bet now. I actually get that skill. Don't learn how to cook. I have no idea how. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm actually just the basics. Yeah, just, you go to a campfire, 
and focus focus on it and then uh yeah you can cook up uh cook up the meat that you you get from hunt whenever i whenever i go up to a campfire i can't seem to uh, you need any sort of equipment no but uh it does not like there's only a few, few certain campfires <laughs> Yo man, <laughs> tuned in at the right I time. The I managed to um it came well I don't know how I think I I don't know if I it came up supernaturally. Um but yeah, I was able to bring it up with the doctors while killing time in Saint Denis, like, oh haven't you heard the haven't you heard the uh the song they sing down on the docks? And Cynthia and Louisa are not fans. They are not fans of the song. I'm you're gonna have to have words with yeah, them, man. You're gonna have to have you. words with them. You'll be like then how you can look you have to ask you know have you heard that I? you heard that like your flex my Sorry, that song? we're just gonna have a quick cooking les lesson oh no problem rocking and rolling <laughs> so with the uh down to the beach i'm strolling left alt muscle hey come on now there's, there's oh the there's enough far place for all of us oh Oh. Oh. He's Do you see it? Damn crazy. Get, uh -huh. get out of here. Oh, hold it down. So look at look at the, the antlers, and then you hold down your left alt muscle, and you should see craft a craft. Crafts cheese singles. Oh. I'm way more excited should... about that than I should be. <laughs> I've been in this county for how long and I've never even bothered cooking. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's just a, your basic What is it I've got on me? Can, you know, I've had it for ages. You know, just stick over the fire. And... Mm -hmm. Oh, I put it in my well, bank. Oh, you. for fuck's sake. Mm. Um, it takes a, it takes a while. Why did I put like, it in I the bank? I haven't even reached level one yet. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> you said for the loading screen music. But you can either sit here. If this one... Yeah, we need to get um. Move too far away. If you go to we need to get the lyrical bench, and donkey to record um, a um. Counting down again. To um, record a like a western like, version of that to, song. Say if you just go People into like, the bakery and the. If you go to the bakery and just sit near the, <laughs> the bench a there. Great meme. It should start counting down. Who the down fuck again. is this? Oh, okay. Thank you, Louisa. Where else do I? Where else can I leave it, Shelly? Where? Where else? I don't have a refrigerator. Oh, and in Blackwater, it's um, there's the the can. Ah, I gotta let it, tables. gotta mm -hmm. let it get some extra flavor. Up okay. There. Okay. Yeah. I think. I think Thanks for like storing crab, rats I'm and sure frogs. Crab bench up there. That's animal cruelty. You can continue cooking at as well. It's fine. Yeah, They're only small at? animals. They have less feelings than big animals. Uh -oh. oh, I thought he was holding a lasso. That wasn't the fog frog, was it? So I remember the fog frog had a character that wore uh, a coat like that. Jeremiah or something. Whoa! Oop. Dirt. Not for a while. Hmm, uh, right, not for like right. an hour or more, I'm afraid. Where is Mr. Dirt? He's dead. He's, he's, he's dead. She was just wondering uh, when we last saw Mr. Dirt. No, I think I'm not right with one of you. Okay. Neo's freaking me out. Down to the beach, Sorry, I'm strolling. General. Yeah, all good. But the seagulls poking my head, not fun. And I say seagulls, not right now. It's gonna be stuck in my head all night now. Thanks, thanks, thanks very much. I'm trying to over the way home. Oh dear. Thank you, Blake Water. Oh my god. I swear to god. 
Boop. Oh. <laughs> I <laughs> know. Uh, I still can't remember that day. Oh, it was so good. So good, man. Now, parrotfish. You, you're aware that shell bunny above you there is Cynthia Wheeler, right? Excellent. Just wanted to be sure. Always got to keep the sheriff up to date. Wait. Hey? Wait a minute. That's you, Wolf, right? Have I got it wrong this whole time? Oh yeah, phew, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I just um no, I just wanted to be sure because um because yeah, Cynthia speaks so highly of Sheriff Wolf. So I just wanted to be sure. Run, piggy! Did that did it just go through the legs of that horse? No, you're right. Got you back safe and sound. Oh. I feel safer already. <laughs> Ready for a, another good night's sleep. All right, ladies, you enjoy the rest of your night. And uh, if I don't Have see you before sleepy. then, I will see you for Taco Tuesday. Oh, yep. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. I've been counting down the days. Mm -hmm. All right. You have a good night. Thank you. you. Thank you again. Anytime. I might, I might skip doing RP Monday night. But then I'll definitely, blah, 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 blah. I'll definitely try and get on for uh, Tuesday night for Taco Tuesday. Head down to Armadillo for that. Um, and then it's very likely that I'll take a break uh, Wednesday night as well. Uh, but then I'll be back on, I will try my best to be on Thursday night. Also for the, um, the law head of departments meeting with the governor. Um, even though Hughes is on leave of absence, it's probably a good thing that I make an appearance at that. And of course the governor brought it up in person today. So, um, and, and of course Cynthia Wheeler has this whole dealio going on where it's like needs support for the doctors. But then the other side of the deal is that Miss Wheel is going to make sure that George is still feeling all positive about coming off his leave of absence and back into the law department. So 
There's a little bit of pressure. Yo, Saint! Probably gonna wrap it up there for the night. Oh, oh, that's the chair. Get in the bed. Oh. Don't mind me. Rocking and rolling. Uh... <laughs> Yo, Feezy. <laughs> Dude, that was so funny when he nearly said Corbs. And he's like, ah, oh, uh, George. <laughs> so funny. So funny. But it's, I don't mind when people do name mistakes. Like, it's, it's just, it's an honest mistake. It's like, it's a, it's a, it's an innocent accident. It's, there's nothing wrong with it. It's funny. When people like then play it off, it's, there's, there's no issue. Like, it's not malicious. It's, it's funny. My body didn't let me on the server today. Oh, had a sleepy night instead. Well, it wasn't super. It wasn't super eventful tonight, but it was a nice change of pace and it was nice and relaxing just escorting um, doctors around and just chatting and and that, which was nice. Um, <laughs> uh, but yeah, I will... Yeah, I'm feeling pretty tired. Um, I've been yawning for the last two hours. And back at work tomorrow. Uh, but yeah, it looks like I'll be back on Tuesday night, Thursday night, and... And then, you know, everything allowing probably, you know, like Saturday and Sunday night again and all that. So, but yeah, thanks for the hangs as always.